Yes. Yay. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, I thought I didn't know it was me. I'm yeah, sorry. Yeah. Cheers, 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 everybody. Cheers, everyone. Cheers, everyone. Cheers. 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 Oh. Yeah, she did her research. <laughs> she did research. I did. You're one wow. of like, you're like one of few people. I think that you're the first right. person that's like not in our circle that got it. Right. That's true. Yeah, yeah. Cheers to that. Well, cheers yeah. to that. I should Double know it. Cheers. I interviewed you like two weeks ago or yes, a week ago. True. That's so. true. That's true. Doesn't matter. <laughs> we still applaud you for doing <laughs> research. Yeah. Well, we're here with the incomparable. Haley Capel, thank you for being here. Thanks for having me. I'm so excited. Thanks for cruising down. Um, shout outs to Nick's laptop for making it <laughs> yeah, <laughs> possible. <laughs> shout out to Nick's laptop, for everybody. For making it possible tonight. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so well, uh, let's give uh, the listeners an overview. You yeah. sing all the time. You have a bunch of records out. Uh, how- kind of. Yeah. Original music. I have like an EP out. So I have like seven songs out. Great. Just because, you know, recording's a little expensive. I know, right? So I've just been working, adding up all the songs into a collection. And then yeah. once I finally have the funds to record, you know, it'll be like, pow, you know? Great. Good call. Yeah. Good call. Any, uh, we have, there's so many studios. I don't know if you've narrowed yeah. down choices or looked around or yeah. anything, but we there's so many uh, people you can easily crank out yeah jams okay with. well yeah. i'll have to hit you up after after this we'll talk yeah yeah, yeah absolutely yeah, do you uh, do you have pe- regular people that you like to go to and mm-hmm. work with or do you have anyone in mind already no i mean i was thinking about using a certain studio that i did my first six songs with um and i did one song with another studio out in newport but it could be a little pricey you know they yeah. do but i mean it's worth it they do a great job but i'm trying to you know get a great product and not you know yeah quality over quantity thousands yep. of dollars <laughs> Fair enough. which is really hard to do yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly are you yeah. taking uh, song by song when you're recording or are you getting together with people to do multiple songs you know i kind of want to do multiple yeah like more than one yeah. but i mean if i had to do one at a time it's, i'm not you know opposed to it you know totally well i mean like the release schedule now is mm-hmm. single 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 singles mm-hmm. Hit the Spotify playlist, single, single, single. So, yeah. I think it's great to put out an album, though. You know, yeah, I think oh, it's, boy, it's, you're preaching to the choir. Uh, yeah, I feel yeah. like it's. A, I don't know. I feel like it's a category of music that represents who you are and that specific, like what you're going through or whatever it is. Like in that, it tells a story. You know, each song is its own. Like, you know, it makes a story, and I Dude, love it. Dude, albums yeah. are the best. Albums yeah. are the best. Albums we miss the best. them. <laughs> yeah. We wish albums still mattered. It's kind of like. Uh, if the book industry said, all right, from now on, we're just going to release chapters. Yeah. Just one chapter at a time. Only short stories. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> so you'll Don't find mind. out what happens to the hero yeah. in a couple months. Yep. Yeah. yeah. I was super excited to come out here. I was listening to your podcast as I was driving down Aww, here. Well, just thank so you. that I, I would know what I to have expect. A <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. No. It's not much. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, you probably very quickly found out that you didn't have to prepare anything, right? Yeah. No, <laughs> like, it was oh, cool. Yeah. It was yeah. cool. It was yeah. dope. I just wanted to know. Yeah. You know? She's like, format. Listening for a format. Format. None. Oh, there is none. Yeah, none. Good. Yeah, no okay, format. Good. Yeah, yeah. I listened to the one about Scientology. That really caught my attention. Oh, dude. Shawnee Pants. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Shawnee. Yeah. All Shawnee Pants. Shout out Shawnee. Yeah, yeah his, his, out Shawnee uh, his grandpa worked for the headquarters of Scientology. Like in for, security or something, yeah, right? Yeah, for years yeah. and years. So that was that was. And fun. he was like was uh, Travolta's security guard when we flew in the airports. So he would like just go and like the... You know, airplane pulls up, and then he would get out, get in his car, and then Sean's grandpa left. Nice. (laughs) Well, I was telling Oliver earlier, like, when back in the day I accidentally joined Scientology, but I didn't actually, like... I didn't know I was joining it because uh-huh. I didn't That's even know what it was. That's how they get you. I'm not even kidding you. Have you ever like been to the place or no. done anything? Uh, so back in the day when I was like 21, I'm like 28 now. So when I was 21. I was say back in the day. Lee. Back in the day. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, I came out here. I moved out here. I didn't know anything about Scientology. And then I literally went to an audition went the day before to look at the building and i was like wow this is huge it looked Gorgeous. like a church yeah, right? yeah, yeah i'm like what the he-? okay so i know where it's at yeah. i came back the next day and i prepared you know music i sang two different songs but before that i walked into this building and everybody was walking around like the shining it was like a hotel everyone in freaking 
It looked like costumes and shit. Like, it was insane. Whoa. It took a turn real quick. Yeah. yeah. And I was like, oh, this is weird. And the lady was like, hi, how may I help you? And I'm like, and there's little kids running around in, like, white dresses. I'm like, what the fuck Ooh, is this? Like, wow. excuse my language, but it was. Oh, no, oh, no. no. It was. Fu- no what the fuck are you talking about? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking it let it out. It was crazy. And then yeah. I, they ended up giving me, like, a personality test. The guy was like, oh, would you like a tour? I'm like, sure. Yeah, check, <laughs> checking your and waves and shit. Yeah, you get like, your e-readings. Yeah. yeah. He's like, what are you here for? And I'm like, I have an audition. And he's like, oh, perfect. In the meantime, would you like a personality test? <laughs> I was like, sure, why not? I love the personality text, you know, learn more about myself. Yeah. Um, but it was so weird. And then somehow he got $230 out of me. And That's how they he get told you. Holy me, shit, on your yeah, audition. They, on my audition, yeah. yeah. And then he, they were like, oh, uh, uh, what did he say? He was like, what do you want to be or what do you want to do? And I told him, I'm like, oh, I want to be a musician. I'm a singer. And he's like, whatever you want to be, we can make it happen for you. We sure can, dude. Not even can you. And Whoa. I went to the audition. After that, they didn't say anything to me about the audition after. I just kept going back and taking classes because they would tell me, like, oh, if you do this, 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 and this, you can do whatever you want. Like, we'll get you yeah. wherever you want as long yeah. as you do our classes. That's how and, they get you. And I didn't get it. Like, during yeah. their classes, like, they were treating me like I was a child. Like, this lady would stand behind me and watch me watch a video on this little TV screen, like the size of that amp, and it was an old school movie. And then all of a sudden, she'd stop the movie no. and feed me crackers. No. <laughs> what no. the fuck? I swear to God, what I swear. And it was crackers what? and carrots, and then she would, oh. but she would stand behind me like I was. Like, there was one chair. There was no, no, no. There was like six chairs lined up. <laughs> And I was only, there was no one else, just me what? sitting in one of them. Whoa. This is crazy. And then she would just watch me. And then, you know in The Shining where the lady's in the bathtub? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. She, yeah. You go up the elevator and all the walls are green and it's like an old school like hotel. And it was just like, it reminded me of The Shining. It was insane. <laughs> Creepy. But get this. So I was doing that for three weeks. Yeah. And then crackers I, and carrots? Yes, crackers and carrots for crackers three weeks. Crackers and carrots. And I was moving up in all my classes or whatever. What and I was super fuck? excited. I'm like, I'm bettering myself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah sure. And yeah, yeah. then uh, I worked in uh, steamers in downtown Fullerton. It was a jazz club. And I used to work there. And my coworker was like, dude, you just freaking join the biggest cult in the entire world <laughs> yeah yeah it's like what are you talking about <laughs> and she showed me she's like it's they call it the celebrity center yeah. ah and yeah the one in downtown la yeah. right yeah yeah. Uh-huh. yeah but they don't call it scientology well, i mean it says scientology but they don't say over oh, scientology we're the celebrity center right, right. Yeah. so and when she showed me that i was like holy fuck fudge yeah like, that's what i'm doing right now yeah, yeah. i'm I doing am, this I'm, right now yeah. I'm, I'm i'm living out this story <laughs> yeah that's so crazy it was insane so i stopped going i Good. quit Good. yeah i threw all the books and magazines and all this <laughs> stuff i got away yeah yeah and God. then they kept calling me and calling uh, me and emailing me yeah, yeah. i literally moved twice and wow. they still know where i live wow. wow and on top of that one time i got a phone wow. call and they were like or no, they they called me and then I hung up and then on the next day it didn't even have a post-it or anything it just said my name and then I opened it up and it said I think we got disconnected dot 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 Whoa. I'm sorry if I offended you like yeah, yeah. Elizabeth or whoever it was and I'm just like what the hell Whoa. like yeah so that's my story. That's all I have to wow. say. Wow. At Holy least you you escaped, though. Dude, yeah. Yeah. It, I was only there Whoa. for like three weeks, but... Hey, that's a, that's I long mean, enough to get honestly, some people. Honestly, I'm from a small town. Like, I never... When I moved out here, I had no idea about that. Like, I had no so idea that sure. existed. Yeah, so where did you move out from? Yeah. Sonora, near so, Yosemite. Okay. Gotcha. Yeah. 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 So I love no, Yosemite. We were going to play Sonora. Winter's Tavern. That's yeah. right. Sonora. And then our truck broke really? down. Yes. Yeah. Wait. Yeah, they were stoked. Sonora, California. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Uh, way like, up in, way like up Like a year ago. Six, yeah, yeah. Six like hours. Two years it was like 11 it's hours like away near, from where we were supposed to be. It's like near um, Yosemite. It really uh-huh. is? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. my gosh. Yeah. You guys could stay at my house next time. All right. <laughs> well, well, shit. We should have played that gig. <laughs> yeah, yeah. When did you get down to the to the concrete jungle? Yeah, when did you? You said it's like seven years ago, right? Or um, I moved down here. In 2012. Okay, okay. eight years. Yeah. 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 Crazy. 
what brought you down? Just trying to do the music thing, going to school, yeah. whatever? Yeah. Yeah. And then okay. there's not really much opportunity in Sonora for sure. what I want to do. You yeah. Know? Right. And so I was like, screw it. Great. Let's yeah. just do it. I have yeah. no money, but let's do it anyway. <laughs> let's roll. Right? None of us <laughs> have money. <laughs> ah, we're musicians. Hey. Ah, the yeah. Life. yeah, yeah. The Starving life. artists. The yeah. best. <laughs> uh, yeah. But you've made it eight years at least. So, yeah. you know, you have you been doing. Me. Yeah, right. You've been doing music the whole time. Um, um, so I went to Fullerton College. And then I was doing that for two years. I joined, I got into the jazz program and I wanted to do a jump off a bridge. So <laughs> after that, I just decided to do it on my own. And, uh, and that's when, um, this guy that I used to work with, he reached out to me and he was like, yo, I have a band you want to join. I'm like, sure. And so it was a funk band, 14 pieces. And I did that for two years and yeah, that's kind of like where it started. And then I quit that and took all the musicians for myself. No, nice. Just kidding. Oh no. yeah. Oh, you should have. <laughs> and they, so a lot of them play with me now. Okay, still cool. in my own band and everything. Rad. Nice. Yeah, it's pretty fun. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so okay, so funk band and then jazz program and then earlier you said drums. Oh yeah. Drummers, by the way, we keep having drummers. Yeah. yeah. What? So what? What's your first instrument? Never have the xylophone. So my very f- like like in third grade first instrument. Recorder. Sure. Tru- oh, that yeah, yeah. it went recorder and then it went the trumpet so i played Sweet. trumpet for three years okay and i sucked <laughs> and it was terrible and my teacher was like you s- basically you suck the teacher. Yeah. <laughs> the teacher told you i was really shy and i really oh. loved like i saw the band and i was like oh my god i want to be in that oh. that's my destiny yeah, yeah. and i wanted to play the fl- freaking clarinet okay. but they didn't have any more so they put me on the cornet uh. i'm not okay with that two completely different instruments I by the know. way they might sound the same no two that's different all instruments. i wanted to yeah. do was be a clarinet player and i didn't get it but anyway don't let your dreams be dreams there's, still, there's still time <laughs> yeah, yeah i'm over it now. Time. i'm over it but uh yeah and then what after that happened uh so i quit that to play the flute so huh? i played the flute because all the girls were playing the flute and sure all yep. the boys i played the flute were, yeah you did yeah yeah nice. that's my main fun. instrument yeah and then Flute's great. i yeah, quit the flute. flute to play the drums yeah go yeah. drums yeah. uh was so that's like your okay what did you grow up listening to then is like oh yeah we're what, diving right in yeah i know i mean yeah. sorry I I, go yeah, for it. yeah. Well, the shirt i mean obviously yeah everyone. i mean beatles, the beatles um, sh- right it's kind of like a mixture of everything you know i don't know about you guys but i oh, yeah. seriously like grew up listening to like acdc and queen That's his band. and Cher. And then you got, like, the next era when, you know, my mom was listening to, like, Backstreet Boys. Yes. So we were listening to all that, got the pop, you know. And now, and then it kind of changes because, like, I listened to a lot of, um, like, in sixth grade, I was all into, like, No Doubt. Oh, and, yeah. you know, uh, Who the Freak, Offspring. And yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Dead Kennedys. I thought I was a rock, like, a punk rock. You, you were. Know? You know, yeah, I got the tie, are. I yeah, got yeah, the bracelets yeah. up my arm, the studded belt. Great. Yeah. Everyone's a punk yeah, in, in, in my middle school. school. Picture, I was like. <laughs> just playing face, you know? <laughs> yeah. Mean mugging. Yeah. But that sounds like good. That sounds like good foundations of rock and roll yeah. already. Like, oh, yeah, yeah for did, sure. did like Avril pull you in? You know, Avril Lavigne. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Yeah. I listened to her not so much. Right. I think I listened right. to more Gwen. Yeah, I was gonna say you said no doubt. So. But yeah, I, I listened to her a little bit. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. So <laughs> so okay. Is it the is it both parents influence ACDC and Queen? Mm-hmm. Yeah, and definitely. Then just mom is Backstreet Boys. No, I mean I would think uh, my dad didn't listen. Obviously, that <laughs> but, like, he was more like Queen, yeah. ACDC. My mom, you know, listened to like Foreigner, Foreigner, um, Journey, all that kind of stuff. It was like a mixture of everything. Sure, you know. And okay. your Teenage Rebellion music was the Offspring, Dead Kennedys. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. yeah, yeah. I was like, yeah, you know. <laughs> all what do you, kind of What do you put on now? Like, uh, while you're driving, what's your go tos? Um, I when I was in the funk band, I listened to a lot of funk. So sure. a lot, a lot. I love like Tina Marie. I love um, you know Rick James. I love oh I love soul music. Sure, that's yeah. like recently what I try to listen to. Totally. Um, cool. My music. I want it to be like a female Prince. Ah, there you Does go. Does that make sense? Of I don't course. Know. Yeah. So Prince like, is pretty feminine already. But yeah, you know. <laughs> so like how hard it would for me to you know do yeah, that? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, Prince all day. Prince, Prince all, all day. Now. So all I don't know. In my head, I was thinking like, you know, when I do my album, I think of like colors and just like, just envision the whole 
package, you know? I'm like female prince is how I would describe it. Like Fair Bruno enough. Mars brings back James Brown, you know? Yeah, what yeah. I mean? he does. So it's mm-hmm. like I want to bring back Prince in Good a call. different way than what's her name? Monet. Does Janelle Monet. Janelle Monet. She does She's more like, James Brownie anyway. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. She does it. Like some of her songs, I'm like, oh my God, she took that from Prince. Very good. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. But I want to do it even more intense, but in my own way. So I'm totally. on my own Sweet. identity. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, of course. Great. Who is uh, Jan- Janelle Monet? Janelle <laughs> Monet. <laughs> Who's that? You don't know Janelle Monet? That's A, that's the right question. <laughs> He's asking the question that America asks. <laughs> yep. Yeah. But uh, besides having like three studio four studio albums yeah Greg, we have she's four won studio grammys. albums <laughs> yeah and having multiple grammys she was on she was in a, she was awesome she song? funds we are young uh she, yeah and she's in like multiple movies she was in hidden figures Greg, she was in Greg. that's great what's her song exactly. uh tightrope okay. okay then if, if all she has is a uh, feature artist probably the big and, one uh, the way what? you make what's me what's feel what? was in yeah Something like that. Uh, that was the one. Yeah, that's the one I. Nope. That sounds like Prince to me. It's, I think it's a Janet rip. Oh, yeah. I never thought of that. When I heard it, I was like, uh, Miss you much. Um, uh, miss yeah. you much. I really miss you much. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. There's a guitar riff in there that sounds like Prince. That's what I thought. Oh, well, she channels Prince so hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So she, hard. she owes Prince yeah. a lot, for sure. Yeah. yeah. And James Brown. And yeah. James Brown. Yeah. <laughs> I have no idea who this is. With the pompadour that what, she wrote. Yeah, yeah. yeah. She, if you see um, pictures, you'll probably recognize her. Yeah? Maybe. Yeah. I think yeah. she's yeah, yeah. sang at his, f- like, funeral or his memorial. I yeah. think she did. Yeah, yeah. I think you're right. She sang one yeah. of the songs. And she did a thing. She did, you know, a little dance. Yeah, yeah Dearly Beloved, like, all that yeah. shit. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, I do know who this is. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. Producer right, Nick. Yeah, yeah. Uh, she always has crazy hair and shit, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. She always does nut stuff with her hair. Great talent. I just, um, I, the industry really, I don't, she shook hands because they just yeah. keep pushing. They keep her. pushing. I mean, I've, I've, I've worked. St- <laughs> I knew her before yeah, she was this cool. Is, this is the one that I know her from. Yeah. That's, oh, that's yeah, like yeah. her signature She's hair. She's been working for a long time. A long time. time. Yeah. I've, I've heard about her in like 12, fi- like 12, 15 years ago when she yeah. was just starting and she was doing like concept album stuff of like yeah. being an Android and stuff. That's it was cool. Right. Yeah. Many <laughs> moons and stuff. That shit's awesome. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Yeah, I knew her before she was cool. Um, but, yeah, do you need another? Yeah, so, no, this oh, I'm yeah. just trying to figure out what it tastes like. This, so, the first part gun. of this episode is brought to us by... Colombiana La Nuestra. I don't know uh, if we're yeah. supposed to drink this whole can. I know, right? It's, it's pretty fucking three sweet. three other I ones know. to and drink. I don't know if sweet. I want to drink. I, I will say, okay, so... It's good, I just... Right, as soon, yeah. as, as, soon as everyone's had enough, we'll just get rid of these and go <laughs> on to the next round. We're going to have leftovers, too, <laughs> by the way. Like, figure out what it tastes like. It's bubble gummy, right? It literally tastes like bubble gum. Bubble gum, that's it? Yeah, yeah. Wow, but, interesting. Yeah, I mean, so spoiler alert. I don't know if any of you have had Inca Cola before. It tastes just like this. So we're gonna Sweet. get. We're pretty much gonna get two of these. <laughs> Sweet. So, yeah. We might go four uh, for four. Yeah, right. All four of them. Because because uh, my original plan was to do uh, root beer off. Yeah. And get multiple kinds of root beer, but the st- I went to two different stores and neither of them had the right <laughs> variety of root beer that I wanted. So fuck There's it. There's never enough varieties of root beer. No, you can never have enough. Same flavor, just yeah. need different brands. Yeah, but the second one I went to was uh, Northgate Market, which is a Latino market, so yeah. I just yeah. bought their cool-looking sodas. Well, good There's a bunch is, of other ones. This is very low sodium, it says. So very, very low. So that's good. Yeah. Cola-flavored, and uh, natural and artificial. Cola with a K, though. With Note the K. K. <laughs> because so Inca Cola is also with a K, and like mm. I said, tastes just like this. Yeah. I wonder why they do that. Yeah. Well, it's all right. It's, it's, it's good. It's not as it's thick as right. Coca-Cola no. or uh, Pepsi. It, do, it doesn't taste anything like Coca-Cola. We'll know in a few minutes if we start like, shaking. Like, if, <laughs> We're going to get if massive like sugar rushes. Insulin anyway. shots come in. So the caffeine, yeah, yeah. did they? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, is there caffeine in this? Let's see. Uh, I don't think There's so. There's got to be. Wait. No, I don't think so. Okay, back. Doesn't say it. Columb- how do you say it? Colombian? Colombia? Colombiana. Colombiana. <laughs> La Colombiana. Nuestra. This is Colombiana. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ding! Ding! <laughs> Bottled <laughs> under the authority of Pastaban, S.A.? Uh, Only 150 calories. Pastaban. Only 150? Oh, boy. Uh. Yeah, there's a lot of sugar. Anyway. Yep. Uh, yep. Yeah. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's a soda, everybody. <laughs> <We're> <laughs> <fine>. <laughs> so, uh, do you currently still play any of the instruments that you have Yeah, I wanted to years? talk more about drums because you said He's drums said, yeah. was... Yeah, well, um, I am the drummer, so, yeah. I haven't in a while. Yeah. I bought a um, like I can I still like read like I can I have my read rhythms book and, stuff. and I'll like practice. Sure, it's not something that 
you know, I thought I was going to be the next Sheila E. Uh, Sheila E is incredible. She's the yeah. she, and obviously I'm not, but like <laughs> in my head, I was like, oh, if I could just practice one song and perform it, like yeah. during like a performance, I think that'd be badass. Sure. You yeah. Know what I mean? mm-hmm. Good call. And then I bought a conga. Yeah. Before COVID happened, and oh. I just haven't touched it since. <laughs> so I'm pissed because oh. I need to get back on it. I always do that. I'll buy some, an yeah. instrument. Like I bought freaking a conga. I bought. What else did I buy? Um, what are those things you blow into? Harmonica. Yes. That's yeah. it. Yeah. Choose harp. <laughs> yes. I'm just like, freak, man. I keep getting all these things and I'll play them and then I forget to Did practice. you really finish it? Yeah. Wow. That you was gonna, fast. I'm going to just die. Yeah. Finish my- yeah. <laughs> die back shock's coming, buddy. Yeah. I'm definitely going to go into shock later. <laughs> um, singing. Yes. You didn't mention that in the instruments, but... Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, we only left off at drums, right? So you yeah. said you picked up drums. Picked up drums. When did you start, like, yeah, singing, um, writing, all that stuff? I did musical theater when ah. I was in school, but I never thought, oh, I'm going to be a singer, you know? I just loved, like, being on stage and acting. Yeah. I wanted to do acting for a long time. Excuse me, I have to burp. Do it. Well, in the mic. In the it's mic. It's the yeah. Inca Cola. Yeah, it's yeah, the yeah. Colombiana. Yeah. Colombiana. Colombiana. Uh, um, yeah. But, uh, yeah, I... What did I do? I didn't even know what I was doing. <laughs> I graduated and I was like, I don't know what I'm doing. I thought I was going to go to art school. I thought I was going to go to fashion school, yeah. acting school. And I'm like, oh, they're all so expensive. Oh, I can't God. afford that. So yeah. I went to the community college in Sonora and I joined a jazz group. And they did. It was not like your traditional jazz group. You could <laughs> literally sing whatever you wanted. And it was what I wanted to do, you know? Sure. I don't know. It was weird. And I had so much freaking fun that I was like, I want to do this for the rest of my life. You yeah. know that feeling like when you're performing and you're just so happy happy and it's just like wow if i could do this for the rest of my life i yeah. will you know what i mean of that course, was yeah. the feeling i got and so after that like year that i took that class i freaking moved down here you got bit yeah awesome yeah. got the bug yeah <laughs> cool that's yeah. awesome singing yeah. inspirations because as a singer like what i mean what did you grow up singing what are you comfortable singing what's your wheelhouse what's um, your karaoke jam covers yeah i will survive Good call. I love singing like old school, you know, very like strong powered songs. Dude, are you an alto? I would say I'm more of a soprano. Okay. I feel like over time I'm a little bit more like mezzo Yeah. Okay. I'm, I've been trying to get into a lower range, okay. but um, definitely more soprano. Gotcha. So. Fair enough. Dude, those, those 70s mm-hmm. uh, soul singers, mm-hmm. the girl groups, uh, the oh, yeah. pipes on those singers oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, are it was unreal. Insane. Yeah. So, yeah, you're, mm-hmm. you're coming out of the gate with I Will Survive. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Excellent. I mean, that's like my go-to, that one. But it's really weird, though, because like I have such a uh, – like different the way a song is when i sing it i'm like okay i either hate it or i really like it you know so i have this huge spectrum of different like artists that i love to sing like yeah. what's up for non blondes yeah. my other go to my yeah. favorite Good i tune. can kill yeah. the sh- oh. you know powerhouse that's that great song. Yeah, yeah. Song, yeah. Um, i will survive but it just like it doesn't it d- um, <sighs> The when you feel it, you feel it. When you it. feel it, you feel it. Yeah, that's what I was trying to say. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? That's exactly yeah. it. Uh, All right. Frank Sinatra, when you've loved yeah. and lost like Frank has. When you've loved and lost. No, like Frank, you know, yeah. it's just yeah. singers. When they connect yeah. to a song, exactly. you're like, this is my jam. I was and all I'm tongue like, twisted and he just freaking knew I get exactly it. what I, I was going to say. <laughs> No, but when you find that connection, you know, they become your, your, your standards, I guess. Yeah. Is there anything that you pick up that is like outside the wheelhouse that you make your own? Like a... a you know, Barry White's way down there. Uh, Radiohead is well um, outside of like, I will survive. Yeah. Ninety nine problems. Know. Do you just sing that <laughs> one? <laughs> I don't know. I yeah. What can I you rap for us? Actually, I'll phrase it a different way. Right. California love, California dream. Yeah. Yeah. I do a step on the scene. I'm hearing hoochie screaming, <laughs> swing from the alcohol and something, 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 something. Hey! 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 All right. Hey! At least something you're fearless. Like yeah. 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 <laughs> but uh, so when you gig, right? When you're yeah. doing. Because we, you know, we're doing our three-hour, four-hour cover gigs because, yeah, same. especially when there's no shows, like, yeah, we got to pay for these walls somehow, yeah. right? Yeah, 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 so that's sure. what we're doing. So in like your three-hour, four-hour set, what do you not like to sing, but they love it? Uh, Ours is social distortion. Ours, yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, Fall and chain easily. <laughs> it's definitely social. I D. think it's. 
Oh wow, thank you. Yeah, this is, Ville. I'm up oh, on Here we go. Yeah, we're we're just Let trying me think to. Think about we're just, that. Yeah, yeah. Open this. New yeah, thing. Thing. yeah. You can you can take Iron a sip and, and ponder. This is a little bit more beer. orange smelling. So okay. This looks like he has a, he's muscles on it. So are we gonna like does this have protein in it's it? It's iron beer. <laughs> it's iron beer, guys. Yeah. It's from 1917. Wait, this can. This can is from 1917. All right. More than 80 years. On a summer's a weird. Ooh, it right. smells like. Cheers. Smell it. Yeah, it kind of smells like lemon. Yeah, it's citrusy. Citrus? Yeah. Oh, very interesting. Mm. Huh. I just oh. spilled it on myself. Yep. Um, That's huh. how you know it's good. It's from Cuba. <laughs> ah, ah. Cuba. Cuba. It's got past the embargo, eh? Yeah, right? Um. <laughs> <Maybe>. <laughs> yeah. Are we even allowed to be drinking this? <laughs> Allegedly. <we're> drinking. <laughs> I don't know what that taste is. Right? It's kind of like. Everything. It is kind of everything y. It's kind it's of like. It's going towards a Dr. Pepper. It's like almost Coke, it's like almost a root beer. Deflated Coke slash lemon taste. I mean, it's not yeah. bad. It is deflated. Maybe like though. Pepsi with lime or lemon, right? It's like not quite one thing. Yeah. Well, it's weird. Again, this is Iron Beer. So iron drink. Beer. This is 1917, uh, 1917 flavor. I like that. Um, it's from 1917, right? Yeah. It says right on here. More than eighty years. It could just say more <laughs> yeah. than a hundred. Yeah, right. Because it's more <laughs> than a hundred. description. Oh, On please. A summer afternoon in 1917, a yep. mule-drawn wooden wagon <laughs> arrived on a popular cafeteria in Havana, Cuba. Havana, uh, Havana. Uh, Sorry, I just had to. Uh, <laughs> oh, oh well, keep going, yeah, keep well, going. Well, mm. Yeah, you got to read you the whole thing. Me? I don't know if I can read. It uh, delivered the first four cases of a new soft drink that would soon be called the National Beverage. Oh. Now, more than 80 years later, Iron Beer is iron, still iron enjoyed beer. for its refreshing flavor with just a hint of island spices. That's what that is. A lot of can change, uh, a lot, excuse me, yeah, no, can I'm change ready. over the years, but not the original flavor of Iron, iron Beer. beer. Yay! <laughs> Well, well, done. well done. Golf clubs. Excellent description. Yeah. Yeah. The and they, national beverage. They definitely of Cuba. all caps it every time. Iron beer. Iron beer. In fact, it doesn't show up on this can in lowercase anywhere. I'm like Are drinking you? this actually pretty fast. I should probably stop. <laughs> <laughs> you like it? <laughs> oh, this is great. Oh, this is great. Yeah, yeah. It's actually not bad. Yeah, it's got those island spices, you know? Dude. Coming from the last huh. one. Not the last one was bad. It kind of yeah, yeah. No, this one of tastes it's like easier rum. to drink for sure. Yeah. It kind of tastes like a rum and coke without having without the rum. Without yeah. the rum. That's the Cuban spice. I feel like it's if you Cuban did spices. add rum, it'd be really good with like a splash of lime or something. Right? Yeah, this would be great to mix with some yeah. rum. Yeah. <laughs> okay, my question Where's for you rum? guys yes. is when you first started, you know, gigging and that kind of stuff, were you very frustrated with how to book? How, like, what was your booking process? We do you have a fake booking agent? You should definitely I do that. Allegedly. I learned about it recently okay. about having one of my friends is like, told yeah. me that he does that. So. Yeah. We do that too. Yeah. In Allegedly. Instantly when we came out here, we realized that having someone book shows for you is very costly and just not worth it for being yeah. someone that's not Actually going to pull anything. in tickets. Oh my yeah. gosh. This is going to make me burp. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so we instantly just started booking shit ourselves. Like Craig yeah. has been booking shit forever. Yeah. So it's just literally just gathering a network for yourself and just bothering to show the right people until you talk to the right person because yeah. eventually you know you hit up Troubadour a gajillion times eventually you're like you need fucking email Matt Matt yeah. at this booking try yeah. try that at stop emailing yeah. us we're not the yeah, fucking don't booking. email booking so at just Troubadour just persistence yeah. and yeah. annoyance and like not feeling bad about doing that because like half the time if you're just a normal nice yeah, person persistence pays off it for feels sure. bad to like bother shit and you think you're gonna yeah. hurt your name and shit but you don't have a fucking name so, mm -hmm. so you have example, to really like understand that it, location it troubadour uh -huh. now is that a type of place where you have to sell tickets it, Are you gonna it really depends if on the person that you're talking to if they know you're gonna pull tickets they're not gonna make you sell tickets but if you're no one they're gonna put you on a way to play night, that thing yeah have to yeah. pay 30 tickets until yeah. you show them that you can pull as yeah. soon as they know you can pull what they want you to they stop yeah, yeah. but it's definitely like I mean, things also got a little more weird now in the past like five years because pay to plays yeah. kind of disappeared. Which is good. Which yeah. is good, yeah. but the venues have mm -hmm. been hit so hard that's why it yeah. disappeared because right. there's no one's going to fucking shows. Right. Yeah. So yeah. like it went from like ha having them be able to do that to like mm -hmm. no one's even paying to play mm -hmm. because no one's coming. No, yeah, you can't even do it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I had this lady <clears throat> that I was referred to from someone else, and uh, she, hmm. he couldn't do a gig, and so 
I filled in for him and that's how I got connections with this agent. Great. And I thought it was going to be really awesome. And then I got kind of turned off because all the places in Hollywood, it's like pay to play type of deal. You have to sell a certain amount of people or you have to bring people, that kind of thing. Yeah. So, and there's always a lineup and Mm -hmm. I'm never, I never really played with a lineup. It like, seven artists because right. they just want to smash everybody in and get right. as many people yeah. out there as possible yeah, yeah. All, all seven of those artists are paying to play yeah you know? yeah, yeah. yeah. So, they bring 10 people there yeah you go. so yeah. that kind of thing um but i was just kind of turned off because we played the attic have you ever been there nope no i think it's the attic yeah and there was a there's like a bar upstairs and it looks like an attic and you play acoustic music and downstairs is it like a dj restaurant all right. dude when i went up there it was like boom, boom, like pounding music. You can even hear the people upstairs. Oh, and all sure. the people I brought, I brought maybe like five people with me. That's all the people that were up there. Yep. You know? And the hmm. lady like emailed me the next day and she was like, I thought you were going to bring people. Yeah. I th- and she was pissed at me. And I'm like, dude, I- I'm not getting paid for this. Like, yeah. You know? Yeah. So I advertise, I do as much as I can, but there was a DJ. You can even hear me anyway. So, yeah. and Sounds there was like LA. three other people. It's very LA of them. And they didn't bring shit either. So yeah. I stopped working with her. But it just was frustrating because <laughs> she keeps emailing me like, can you do this? Can you do that? And I'm like, uh, no, I can't because I'm yeah. just turned off. Right. You know? Am I playing at the attic? Then I'm not going to play it. Yeah. Right. Like, yeah. Do you think it's worth it to do stuff like that? Just to uh, play pay to play? like that? No. Nope. No. no. I did so many. And then it got me good leads to a certain point. Yeah. You know? But the one thing is, is like you're playing live shows to build an audience, not to yeah. become friends with a <laughs> the promoter. Who, yeah. 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 Exactly. And if you are paying to play and you're making a promoter happy yeah. and gaining no following due to it, or yeah. just, just losing money. due to it, but yeah. just because there's nothing there, yeah. that sounds like you're helping that dude pay his rent. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And that's why he's nice to you. Yeah. yeah. They're, they're a dime a dozen. Yeah, there's, there's, oh, yeah, so there's so many. many. Yeah. yeah. It, yeah. It, it sucks how yeah. many there are. Mm-hmm. Especially when you, like, you hit up, a, like, a reputable venue, um, and then they pass you off to a third-party promoter yeah. that right. is just mm-hmm. terrible. And you'll run into this all the time, and it ruins relationships with good venues yeah. mm-hmm. that you could develop a fan mm-hmm. base and a, and a following mm-hmm. ad. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to think of one that, that happened to us, but I think I wrote them off in my mind. Molly Malone's Molly one. Molly Malone's is a good one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I've heard of them. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, have you ever remember. heard of uh, Raw? Like, have you ever done, looked up Raw? Oh, my God. That's so funny that you bring that up. Um, uh, yeah. I was going to be on the, the creative board for that when they were launching it. Um, a couple events in Long Beach. Yeah. Where do they, when did you run across them? So, This I, is like 10 years ago now. I, uh looked it up online and they reached out to me and they really liked me yeah. and then they told me oh you have to sell 20 th- tickets yeah. for 20 dollars yeah so i'm like okay and i literally did it but it was like people bought it from me like over facebook i emailed so many people i think i had to pay for like two because that's like 400 bucks right yeah. you know yeah. and it's not and this was when i first moved out here too so i didn't really know a whole bunch of people like right. my roommates and stuff but they all had to work you know <laughs> yeah. i did um hollywood or boulevard three that venue in Hollywood Boulevard 3 I think they always rent out really legit yeah. places they're legit places yeah. they're super dope Boulevard yeah. 3 and then I did Exchange LA and Exchange then LA I, is cool yeah, yeah that place was dope yeah. and then I drove all the way to San Francisco with my freaking 12 piece band and we played in San Francisco and that was Hell super yeah. dope cool um, that was fun and then yeah but it was just like I had to pay a lot of money yeah. and I, I couldn't you know that money I could have used to pay my musicians to, yeah. or pay for the space that we were at or food totally. or something. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Totally. So. A full length record. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> is Raw is yeah. Raw yeah. the one where everyone's like sitting on the ground? No, no, no that's so far. So oh, far. Yeah. So far. Yeah, that's so far. Yeah, there's still too cool for us. By the way, yeah. still dude, fuck so far. <laughs> uh, you heard it here first, yeah. folks. <laughs> Allegedly, yeah. I don't want to burn the bridge, but yeah. Yeah. it's already done, dude. Yeah. Just did. Trump yeah. fans are on the bridge. <laughs> <laughs> we can't get on. So far, are all Trump voters. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, no, I do have a couple friends. Though. Oh no, sorry. Go ahead. No, no, I was. That's all. Uh, um, but I had a question. What was my question? Oh no, it wasn't a question. It was just that yeah, the fake booking agent thing actually does yeah. work. Yeah. Um, just. Because for the sheer psychological value of yeah. you are not the band going on your knees. You're mm-hmm. having someone represent you. Yeah. And it's as easy yeah. as just making up someone's name. We actually have an awesome booking agent named Chris Dodson. Shout out Chris yeah, Dodson. Chris Shout out Chris Dodson. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and just uh, make sure you, you have a good pitch. 
Yeah. You know, yeah, honestly. Put all your little cool like, things on there that are your accolades and wherever it is that you actually stern. Wa- yeah, mm-hmm. where you actually want to play, like just ground game, right? Mm-hmm. And uh, a good example, Di Piazza's shout out Mark Di Piazza, he he left the club, but he ran live music there mm-hmm. for, for like forty years. Thirty, forty years. Oh wow. He did not answer phone call uh, he didn't answer emails, only phone call. He oh, wow. only took phone call. Mm-hmm. And when you called him, he's like, "Yeah, I can get you a date. We're just we're three months out," mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and that's just yeah. how he operates. So, oh, wow. all the people that I've talked to, like, I email them all the time. They never get back to me. Yeah, they don't. Yeah, he that's not how it works because he's yeah. always by phone. Oh, um, wow, that's crazy. Costa Mesa, Wayfair, no phone, no, no email. email. Yeah, just, just show up. Yeah, and talk to Eric. Yeah, you go yeah. to go, go to, to like Wayfair and ask for Eric. That's so funny because I've been yeah. there or I've emailed him then multiple times. It's not gonna oh, work. Yeah. Yep, you should go just go there. Talk to on like a Tuesday, go in. And, ask for Eric. and just yeah. ask for Eric and just grab a drink and some food and ask for Eric and be like, hey, I came by a bottle and just pitch yourself that way. Yep. And you'll literally, he'll probably be like, yeah, you know, when shows come back. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right, yeah. Uh, yeah, at this point, you know. Whatever. It might yeah. be, yeah. It, it might not be the best slot or whatever, but okay, if you start show. showing it, then they're happy. And yeah, but they, they, the thing back. is, you know, littering the canvas with emails is awesome and you'll get a lot of responses, mm-hmm. uh, but. Quality. <laughs> Quality. Yeah to, yeah. to get places that you really, really want, you know, just. Just go outside of the box, you know. Yeah. Talk to other bands that have been there. See if you can get a show together with them and yeah. other friends' bands. Create a that card is a good way like too. That. Is like yeah, a friend band like Build jump on their show. We've, yeah. we've created more cards than than I can. And we should. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we so, should. So we'll hit up a, hit up a venue and say, hey, we're gonna play, and we already have a full card. We got three other bands ready to go, which oh, not cool. only helps them, mm-hmm. helps all of us too, yeah. because we're already coordinated. We like each other. It's gonna yeah. be a good. Show. Mix of an yeah. evening too. Yeah, yeah. Oh, so. that's dope. Yeah, that's yeah. super cool. I would say we only create cards. We actually, yeah, we actually stopped. either jump on to good ones or we or, stopped yeah. taking shows where the card didn't make sense for us. Because we would play shows that have a metal band, metal and then bands, a chick, and, yeah. a singer songwriter, mm-hmm. and then and it would be like between. ska, yeah. and then us. We'd be like, Jesus Christ! Yeah. So this is like the weirdest. Like, yeah, yeah. And, <laughs> you see matter. It, and you yeah. see it too. Yeah. You'll see like the friends that came for those people, and then and they leave. Go. After you'll have their the, band you'll have the bar yeah. patrons that are like chill, and they'll they'll hang out with yeah. you. You know, it's like a couple, and yeah. then you'll have your friends. Mm-hmm. Those your friends aren't staying for the metal band. They didn't come for metal. Yeah, yeah. So they're outside smoking cigarettes as the singer songwriters on. Yeah, yeah. So That's we, we kind of stopped doing that because it didn't do us any good. We're just yeah. playing for our friends mm-hmm. and not creating an event, creating a night for everyone to yeah. enjoy. Right. So, exactly. Yeah. I can see that. Yeah. 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 House of Vibes, plus you get to see all your friends' fans. <laughs> 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 and it, it helps build like a vibrant mm-hmm. music scene. Everyone yeah. like always like, support the scene, support the scene. No, just make the scene yourself. It. Yeah. yeah. Just, just yeah. Have, a, have a thing and it'll just help you out tenfold every time. Yeah. Did you guys ever do weddings or have you done weddings? Oh, yes. yeah. We've, we've done several them, weddings. We've told them multiple times we are not a wedding band. Mm-hmm. Multiple times. Yeah. And if they still want us to do it, we'll do it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And they say, great, we've seen you. We yeah. love it. We're like, all right. Oh, that's cool. This yeah. is what you want for your wedding. That's yeah. good. It's it's good money. It's great money. Yeah. It is. Wedding, ta- cool. wedding tax is real. I did a wedding in January, and it was one of my – no, I'm sorry, in last September. Mm. And it was one of my friends' weddings. And it was really fun, but, man, it was a lot of work. And yeah, a lot of work. they always they always ask more of you than you're willing to do. Yeah, well, yeah. also too, it, to do. it was my friend, so like I'm not gonna yeah. charge him like what yeah. I'm Bro supposed deal. to. Bro deal. Yeah. So I think I charged him like twenty five hundred. But about right. yeah. there was eight of us. Okay. And that splits real fast. That does yeah, split real so fast. So we we played we played a lot, and yeah. I was like at one point like announcing tables to get up and. You know, it happens, yeah. you become an MC. I you was become an MC, an MC but yeah. there was an MC there. It was just like a lot of work. Which don't get me wrong, like it was a really great time, and I love them. Yeah. Um, I love my my friends and everything. Yeah, but you're you're the it musician like, and, the and the band. Band. <laughs> It was just like I was the only singer too, so oh, yeah. it was like it's on you. Yeah. yeah, your voice is it gone. It was a really good learning experience. I mean, sure. we've done weddings before, but it was just like. <laughs> probably one of the biggest ones we've done yeah. and then yeah and then in january i don't want to be a wedding band but of it's course like, not dude i want to yeah. quit my job like dude those you know what I mean? the money for weddings is, is dude, yeah. wedding so, tax not is even real. quitting your yeah. job but just having extra cash like oh, yeah. if you yeah, right. if you book a really good one then you have songs money yeah. for songs january yeah. so. we did i did a um a bridal show in redondo beach cool and i set up a booth i mean i had to pay for it but i was like i want to see how this works yeah i got like 35 leads mm. and COVID happened. So uh, I was like, mm, 
No weddings for me. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> now bummer. you're singing reception over Zoom. I know. <laughs> you know. People have asked me about that, and I'm just like, I don't even know how that works. Like, I don't even know how to do that. So <laughs> I feel like it would sound like crap. We did live streams on Facebook yeah, it definitely doesn't for a sound while. Great, it doesn't sound you great. Need, you need yeah. money for good equipment. Right. Yeah. So yeah. We, we just did a Zoom one to test that for last week's Dookie thing. Dookie's. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> which uh, which one do you like better? I don't know. <laughs> but uh, it even still doesn't come out, you know, it comes out as good as what you think it's going to. Did it's you say Dookie? Yeah. Yeah. We played all of Green Day's Dookie last week, last Friday. Yeah, last Friday. Yeah. From start to finish. Yeah. We just I'm learned it and played it. It was fun. That's cool. It was That's basically awesome. a Halloween <laughs> thing. Uh, yeah. Uh, so, I just new question, new topic. Okay. Worst on. segue ever. When did you start writing songs? really hard because like i don't really consider myself a writer okay i mean i like writing in groups okay you know? my oh, brain cool. doesn't think that way i think of myself more as a performer than a writer sure if that makes sense of course um but like when i get an idea like for the songs i do have i don't know if you've heard any of my stuff but um the songs i do have i wrote like seven years ago so all the stuff that <laughs> i have out now was like when i was 21 okay gotcha. you know so yeah. it's been a pretty good gap you know <laughs> sure, sure. but i would i would tell them i have an idea i want it to sound like this and they kind of helped form it with me yeah so i feel like my writing style now is a lot better than what it used to sure so makes sense yeah yeah, yeah i mean i mean there's there's i mean writing and performing are two different things yeah. but you know not everyone has to do both i was just curious yeah, yeah. i, I, I kind of get an idea mm -hmm. like i want i have a vision of like how i know this sounds really weird but like how i want to look what i want the video to be like no. kind of like all this stuff and then the song kind of forms from that if that makes sense totally yeah i mean great that's great yeah, i we, wish we don't any have of that the, at all we, like, i was gonna say i wish any like, of the three a, of us had something yeah. like that totally yeah. opposite so like yeah. we need a music video for this song we're like cool we wrote the song can you figure out the music video <laughs> yeah. so like for example like my song i have one called begging and i wrote it about an ex and in the second verse it goes um i'm the judge the jury and the prosecutor so like in my head i was like i was thinking of like a courtroom and there's like a whole bunch of me's like but Great. i'm dressed as the fucking judge yeah the right. jury and the prosecutor and, and, this, yeah, yeah. and i'm just like and you're arrested like in the jumpsuit you know type of thing and yeah, so yeah. i'm like you know great Makes sense you know makes what sense. i mean yeah. yeah so that kind of stuff just like, I think in vision. Yeah, no, it makes sense. None, like I said, yeah, none of the three of us do people. that. We're not the yeah. visual type, so that's yeah. why we always. No. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. no. So we're jealous. We're horrible. Basically. Yeah, we're pretty jealous. <laughs> Mine's a 15 <laughs> second voicemail when I go, is this anything? Is this anything? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then I do that too, though. I'll be in the All car right. and I'll be like, eh, baby, like whatever it is. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? And like, I'll be like, oh yeah, that sounds good, or no, it doesn't. Yeah, yeah. You right. Know? You just. Yeah, yeah totally. our writing style is totally just crazy. Going, I got this lick. Do we like this? <laughs> is this good? Is this good enough to expand on? Do, yeah, we, yeah. do we like this? Yeah, is this it? anything? What do you yeah. think a verse would be? Then let's just write it out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, I think it's too like sometimes I'll go on like Garage Man and I'll get uh, I'll put something on a loop and right. then I'll just be like, okay, get inspired, make up yeah. a melody from that yeah. and just kind of like don't actually use that. But when I bring in the studio, they'll help me like write the actual music for sure, it. Sure, yeah. yeah, great. That's what it's there oh for. My God, I burped yeah. like six times. Well, it's the carbonated. Now it's uh, oh, no, it's iron beer. We iron definitely, bur I've definitely burped directly into this mic like a thousand <laughs> times yeah. Th throughout my career of consistently. Reverb oh yeah, we have, we have. I yeah. burp into this mic all the time. There's, there's, uh, you know, if you farted in it, that'd be something new. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I would want to put my mouth up here. If do that. Yeah, yeah. Afterwards, it's yeah. the only one that we disinfect. Okay. That's the why we gave it to you. Cool. Okay, that's cool. I that's guess cool we'll close that. the episode. We know how to. Yeah. <laughs> right. <Aww. laughs> yeah. On three, everybody. Yeah, on three. <laughs> yeah. We'll close the episode that way. Um, okay. So, uh, Sonora. I think we got that. I think I got everything but social security number, so we're going to get okay. that way. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> zero, 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 <laughs> zero, zero, zero. Um, outside, of, outside of music stuff, <laughs> um, I mean, there's been a lockdown. So have you been watching movies? Have you been watching Yeah, we've been doing it on your um, lockdown. I gained your 15 core. pounds. What? And you might not really? look like it. Oh, my gosh. That's impossible. I've gained 15 pounds for okay, sure. Okay, well, my, <laughs> my luck was a little different. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hang on. Pause. Yes. I'll tell you the story in a second. We have another one we have to try. Oh, yeah. Yep. Another soda. This Milka. looks like it's from Chick-fil-A. It's called Milka. 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 Wait, let's guess. Soda What do you think it's going to taste like? It's red soda. It's red soda. It's red soda. Hopefully soda? strawberry. Hopefully let's strawberry. Hope. I'm going to go with cherry. Okay. Roja? I'm going to go with Raja. like Texas red cream. This one is 
40 more calories. Oh. Uh-oh. Wait, what was, what was Iron Beer? I think it was 150. Was All it? right, well. Yeah, the other, no, this is 192. Oh, it was? Yeah, yeah. Was uh, the first one was 150. Okay. Okay. Oh, right, here we go. Smell oh it? my god. Oh, that is on everything. I can smell yours. Dude. Yeah, I haven't even opened mine. I smelled it. Mm. Mm. It's like strawberry and then like it's a red. bunch Whoa. of like bunch it's of red spices. Red. It's spicy. Yeah. It smells like bubble gum again to me. Yeah, but Ooh. it's spicy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, that's strawberry bubble gum. Well, that's interesting or indeed. So, I don't even I know like what strawberry is. Is mine different? It's spicy. <laughs> <laughs> One can in every six pack is a different <laughs> <Yeah>. flavor. <laughs> to me, it smells like bubble gum again. Smell that. It, no, is, it, does. it is pretty bubblegum. Really yeah, it no, it, it's got the bubblegum smell for sure, but the I taste... I have spices. What is cola mm. supposed to be like? It was I only the first... When it crisped open, oh. I was like, it smells to like To me, spices. this tastes just no, like... No, I got the one. spicy taste, yeah. too. Yeah. Oh. It's just like the first one. Maybe, like, there's some, like, fruit in it or something. <laughs> Keep going back to cola. <laughs> 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 gotta compare. <laughs> Let's do an ABC so comparison. this one... I like the first this. one, the Columbia Law right. one, I'm back. is like a little oh, lighter. You okay. know what? Okay. All right. This one almost kind of like has like a red vine taste to it. Which one? The, the, the milka? Mm. No. The, the yellow. That one Columbia This is more like cotton candy-ish to me. More like with like a red vine. <laughs> yeah. Or just bad licorice. That bad dry licorice. I, could ta- I, could I was going to say, my palate's getting pretty shot, too. I know, mine, too. <laughs> I was like, I need some pepper yeah, or something. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. You know what? I can't taste anything anymore. I think I have COVID. <laughs> Don't say that. Just all of a sudden. <laughs> <laughs> Got it. Yeah. You see the light in my eyes turn on? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Infected. Um, uh, I don't. Strawberry. Yep. Yeah. There's tastes something like spicy weirdness in there's this. There's just one. something. It definitely tastes like cotton candy to me or bubblegum. Yes. Can- is there a clove in there? I know. There, it's some sort of spice. I don't know what it is. I don't taste any spice. Oh, I love this experiment. Yeah. This was That's great. Thanks. Yeah. yeah. I, mean, I like it. Yeah. Is there a is there a fourth one? The fourth one I will <laughs> I can already spoil. I can already spoil. It tastes a lot like the first one. So well, which we so will it tastes see. like we the first see. and the third. Yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah. We almost went four for four. Yeah. We're gonna have these you know varying degrees between them. We, yeah, yeah. We could be Mexican cola. Uh, you know. So far is this one. You like Columbia the first one best? First? Okay. This one. Oh, iron, iron beer. I don't know why. I think it kind of tastes like a deflated, like, <laughs> Arnold Palmer or something. Yeah. I get it. I get it. Like, I dig that. <laughs> That's what you know? This one's not as old as iron beer. It's only 60 years old. It's Ooh, cold. Wow. Oh, you know what it oh. tastes like? Oh. What? Have you ever had those? Chicken feet. Um, <laughs> what is it? No, not that. <laughs> but... One of those lemonade it's, uh, that's like lemonade and iced tea in that's the can. That's an Arnold Palmer. Oh, yeah, in Arizona. a can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Arizona or something. It tastes like that. It okay. kind of does. I get it. It's it <laughs> There's definitely a citrusy thing on that one for yeah. sure. It's yeah. got something in there. Yeah. It's got something. I do not know. Anyway, about COVID though. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah. About about your lockdown. Yeah, your car. Yeah. yeah. So I ended up. Okay. So my birthday's in February. Mm-hmm. So Happy birthday. Hey, we're the fourth, if you want to know. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Um, what did I do? Oh, so I work all holiday season because I am a server, you know. Okay. Yeah. Server during the day, musician. Starving artist. Yep. Shout out yeah. serving artist. Yep. Yes. So I took two weeks off after holiday season because I was beat. Mm-hmm. And then I went home, saw my family. Spent all my money at the casino because that's what I like nice. to do. Hell yeah. Gamble, Sweet. roulette, you know. There you go. Um, <laughs> Texas Hold'em, roulette. my favorite. If you want to gamble Damn. sometimes, let me know. Wow. Um, we'll go to Vegas and play poker. We I love it. Band down. Um, so down. What was my story? Oh, yeah. So I already took two weeks off. I yeah. came back. I worked one shift. And then that following Tuesday, the 17th, everything shut down. Wow. I'm like, well, this sucks. So I waited a week. We waited another week. And then me and my boyfriend drove to Oregon because his mom and dad have a house out in Oregon. Ah, that's a good place to lock down. And we were there for a week, two weeks, three weeks. (laughs) Oh, it's a month. And now it's like a month and a half. And we just stayed out there because nothing was happening. Yeah, Yeah. And during that time, I had probably two cherry cokes a day which i don't drink so i never drink except for iron except, beer yeah. <laughs> i normally don't drink so yeah, yeah. it's just not my choice of beverage sure, yeah, you yeah, know yeah. um except on special occasions you know? right and right. i drink so much soda <laughs> um my boyfriend's sister works at tillamook the ice cream factory ah, yeah. yeah i love tillamook Girl, yeah. every night oh come on she brought home a tub of ice cream oh fries. so it was like soda Soda, ice, ice cream, <laughs> ice cream, cheese, co- um, the f- the ramen like bowls oh, yeah. you pour yeah, hot yeah. water in. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Beer till like 
playing uh, King's Cup, playing just like we made our own drinking games. Have you ever played Spoons? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, the the so, card game, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you have to like pass. The, yeah, and we you should play that one. sometime. Oh it my is god, fun that'd one. be fun. <laughs> yeah. But who would ever go out first? Because there was four of us. Whoever mm-hmm. would go out first has to take a shot. Uh, we went through a whole bottle, and like his mom's bottle of her secret stash, which we had to replace. <laughs> but yeah, it was intense. So there were a lot of drunken nights, and that's why I gained like twelve pounds. Hey, fair enough. Nice. I mean, what else are you gonna do in lockdown? Yeah, you right? know? Yeah, I don't blame you. Yeah. That's fair. House on the beach, fuck it. Yeah, I mean that, that yeah. sounds yeah. awesome. Yeah. Sounds there's worse places when, to to be. Then when did you yeah. come back? Yeah. Um, uh, we came back like a month later. Okay. okay. <laughs> a month, a month and a half later. But then I stayed, and then my boyfriend went back for another month because uh-huh. I didn't know what was gonna happen yeah. and sure. like if yeah. we were gonna go back to work or not. So when he went back to work, that's when I bought a ticket to go back, too later on because I'm like, oh, this is gonna want forever, and yeah. I'm okay with it for now, whatever. And then I had to go back, so I didn't get to go. Oh. No. Welcome back. Yeah. Welcome. <laughs> <laughs> and it's been six months. And no, I don't yeah. want to sound selfish, and I know it's probably going to come off, uh, come across that way, but I was like, it was so nice to have a break from work. Because when you're go, 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 go all the time, yeah. in my, like, 12 years, I've never had holiday off of course ever in my life yeah because right. server industry you don't get to have no. a mother's day that's no. the worst day of the year yeah mm. um easter whatever like no. i was like oh my god this is a blessing in disguise yeah <laughs> i feel hey. bad not it's not it's like terrible for all the there people. are yeah there yeah. are silver linings you know, yeah you, you gotta you gotta mean? pull something positive out of it yeah. otherwise you're but gonna be at home not making kill money yourself yeah doing nothing <laughs> yeah you're like i really needed a break but not like this honestly yeah. all the servers felt the same way we're like it's terrible what's going on in the world but it's yeah. like just nice to have yeah a time off you right know? Yeah. Yeah. of course yeah did uh did they bring you back to work they bar- um, brought us back on june 4th okay june 4th okay yeah. And then right rocking since then and we it's been like holiday season all over again oh my, oh my god. god so many people are coming out fuck yeah i bet <laughs> even more than before probably yeah my day job is u-haul and the oh. amount of people that are moving out of the state Mm-hmm. Every day is the summer. Yeah. It's like Tuesday, and I don't oh have any God. trucks. I'm like, is this ever going to fucking end? Yeah. Like, last year at this time, it was chill. <laughs> like, I'm yeah. like, 10 people a day, and I'm like, shooing people away. Like, I don't have anything. Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. It's, <laughs> it's insane. Dude. It's literally insane. And then it's like, people get upset. You know, they'll be like, mad at us, or, you know, it's just like, you need to relax. I got to burp again. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> Dude, I, the mic. I, I think everyone, everyone in America should have at least two weeks as a food server like yeah, yeah just it should be required day. just required. one day yeah, yeah one day they, they deserve a quarter of their life yeah but i can tell you so many stories okay tell me what you think about this do you guys watch the office <laughs> mm-hmm. absolutely do you like the office yes yeah, mm-hmm. my favorite show. okay it's my favorite sh- one of my favorite shows of all time sure i want to write i've been writing a script <laughs> and it's gonna be called extra plates ah and it's gonna be like I want it to be, I want, it would be awesome if I could send it to like the writers of the office Yeah. because every single thing actually happened to me <laughs> and you wouldn't believe it. Sure. You know what I mean? Yeah, of and course. Characters just, just like the office, but in a restaurant. Extra yeah. plates like, is a fantastic. It's a good name. Dude. Yeah. yeah. So good. I've got a customer that I dealt with and he told me his name was Dracula. <laughs> Oh yeah, that yeah. Really. <laughs> one of my wow. one of my coworkers got hit in the head with a hammer. Oh, yeah, crazy. <laughs> yeah, I got so good with. Oh oh I just I can't even believe the shit that happens. Like, yeah. you don't even know. Like it's just oh the no. service industry is great. Suck. Oh, it's the worst. Like yeah, and and moving so so food and logistics. Those are two like equally volatile. never going to go away always going to be there yeah and they're equally yeah. volatile when it comes to the u- to the user yeah it's like the baseline like, of humanity if anything happens in those oh. situations yeah. people lose their minds it's yeah. crazy we're it's crazy. S- we're seating outside yeah yeah yeah, if yeah. you don't want to sit outside, don't come in. Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? There's no other choice. You know where to go. Like, sorry, I just get passionate. And then about be like, no, of course. And I'll be like, oh, what about that booth there? Uh, we're sitting outside. Yeah. Well, that's empty. We're we're, we're not sitting, sitting anybody. This yeah. lady literally runs over to me, on my table. She was one of the last tables. Her and her <laughs> husband. She's like, this is our first time here, and I'm like, oh my god. Yeah, congratulations. Yeah. 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 I'll make your experience wonderful. Because it's yeah. more of like a fine dining restaurant, so yeah. you okay. want to like schmooze and what, uh, whatever. What area are you Get in? a good tip. Uh, in f- uh, it's Fullerton, sure. Brea-ish yeah, yeah, yeah. cut off. Okay, yeah. Um, but yeah, no, this lady like 
first she complained about her temperatures of her meat and I was Oof. like okay fine whatever <laughs> what yeah. I know I was gonna say that as soon as it came out I was like oh someone's gonna say something and then as I was like getting it fixed she runs over to me and she's like we have a serious problem. Uh oh. And I'm like, I thought her husband had a stroke. That's how intense it was. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. She goes, there are ants on me. And I'm like, oh my God. Yeah. Like, it sounded like there was a swarm of ants covering her entire table and they were like attacking her, you know? Yeah, the yeah. ants are moving my chair. <laughs> there was like one on her leg and one on her arm. I literally moved him to another table. Yeah, yeah. Got him all new food. It was probably four hundred dollars worth of food, just her and her husband. Yeah. Then at the very end, like they pay it. She's being a biatch still. They leave. She comes back in. She's like, "They're in my purse. Uh, nah, nah, you didn't caught my meal." I'm like, "Dude, it's a fucking you're aunt. out. Yeah, and you're, you're outside. outside. Yeah, you yeah. wanted to sit next to the bush. Like, <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, it doesn't make sense." <laughs> I assume your tip was pretty shitty too. Oh, they caught the whole bill, so oh, I included okay. my tip too. Oh, so it's like, what, you know? what pussy ass cus- like right? companies like, yeah. do? Are you kidding me? Customer yeah. is not always right. Customer is not the always customers. right. Yeah. It, it's just sad though, just because like people, are, like we're in a pandemic, dude. This is yeah. how servers make their money. Right. And obviously, I don't want to be a server, but you yeah. know, the music industry was struggling for a minute, so still I have is. To keep, yeah. So I have to keep yeah, my job. What live you know? shows? <laughs> I know. Treat the people well that serve you food. Just do it. Boogers in cum. Boogers in cum. Everybody's got their boogers in cum. It's just smart for people to do that. And just a tip. Yeah. Don't order hot tea because the cups you know are not going to get clean well or coffee. So no, mugs. Yeah. no mugs. No mugs. Fair enough. No you know mugs. how hard it is yeah. to scrape that lipstick off? <laughs> 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 you got that red lipstick, and all we do is get some hot water and go pew, pew, pew. Ooh. <laughs> all right. Good to know from the end. Avoiding oh, yeah. tea. Yeah. Avoiding <laughs> tea. Yeah. Avoiding. Good to know. Pro tip. Yeah. No more tea. Just give me one yeah. But uh, that, <clears throat> they treat you well enough that you, I mean, you went back. Yeah. I mean, it's probably the best, one of the best jobs I've ever had. That's serving great. How long have you been there? Know? Uh, four years now. Okay. What is yeah. this place? Okay. A restaurant. I don't know if I want to name it. Uh, fair, fair enough. Just yeah. because I don't want someone to come after yeah, me. Yeah, more than yeah. a restaurant. <laughs> shout out that restaurant. Shout yeah. out that restaurant. Yeah, yeah, they do a great job, you yeah. know. Yeah. Awesome. More s- more steak fish type place? You said uh, more bougie, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah, a little bit more up there. Fans. 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 Bottles of wine. $400 yeah. for two yeah, people. Yeah, yeah. 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 said 400 yeah. bucks. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Fair enough. She works at the Playboy Mansion. I wish. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, so in in lockdown times, have you been watching lots of movies, watching TV shows? Uh, what have you been? Did you, you been rewatch yeah. The Office? Did you I, rewatch I, The Office? No, yeah. I got obsessed with Big Brother. Oh, and ah. I I wanted I auditioned last year for it. Okay, nice. and then like COVID happened, so they just ended up doing an All Star season. But I literally watched all like. 30 seasons and Sweet. each season has like 40 s- episodes oh and I literally sat Jesus at the computer Christ. every single day in Oregon <laughs> and watched that and then after that I moved on to Survivor which wow. is the same thing it is. Yeah, yeah. just on an island <laughs> yeah. so I did that what yeah. else did I watch I think that was it no, Big that's impressive. I mean, <laughs> that's just For impressive. As many seasons with as many episodes. Yeah. Are they you don't have any other time? I think they're hour yeah. long. Yeah, 120 yeah. hours. I would kind of skip through it a little bit just okay. to know who won and everything. Skip but the recaps. and Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah I hate yeah. the episode with Beth on it. Right? Yeah. Fair enough. All yeah. right, Big Brother. Think, what else did I watch? I think that's it. Okay. I mean, that's a lot of What's that's a lot of viewing hours, like you said. La La Serena? La, that scary movie? That Spanish movie where La the Sirena? La, yeah. Yeah. We watched that. I couldn't do it. <laughs> I heard about it. I didn't see it. Eating I'd babies never... or something. I couldn't do it. Really? Ooh. Yeah. It's it's some. I, yeah. I think it was, is in Spanish and it's some horror movie thing. The lady from Scooby Doo who plays Velma. No. Am I thinking of Flintstones? I don't know. I don't. Know. <laughs> She's in it. She, the girl in Scooby Doo. She wears the orange. She's Velma. In it. Yeah. She's in it. Okay. What I knew her name at one point. What is this called? We talked about her recently. We did. La- Shit. La Sierra. Oh, La no. Sierra. Linda La- Cardellini. Bam! Pulled that shit out of wow. my ass. Straight out of the ass. Straight out of the wow. ass. Yeah. Right out of your butt, La Sierra. Yeah. <laughs> La Sierra. Sirena, I think. Sirena yeah. or something? Yeah, like the siren. Yeah. Any great movies? You, I mean, I really haven't. I've, I have uh, I went through mm-hmm. a greatest movie list. Wait, is so, it? 
the curse of La Lorna? La no. Lorna. Oh, yeah. Llorona? I think that's it. Oh, is that it? Okay. Yeah. La Sirena. Yeah, La Sirena. Yeah. Okay. Something like that. I think there's one called La Sirena too. <coughs> there probably is. Yeah. I, I didn't really look know. through all of her thing. I just went to the one that was like from last year. She eats kids or she takes kids cuz she mm. killed her own kid. Does she eat kids and take <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I don't like horror movies at all. I, I don't think I've seen a really great movie, but I've seen a lot of terrible movies. Yes. Fair enough. Yeah. Like what? Um <laughs> The worst movie I think I've ever seen was What's that movie with the tree man? tree man and he like has the really long arms and if you call his name slender man yes that's the worst <laughs> movie i've ever seen in my life <laughs> fair enough oh my god <laughs> slender freaky man okay okay oh, no you can say it it's slender fucking man yeah, yeah. yeah. Slender, slender fucking freaking man. fucking slender man <laughs> um, literally there the was porno, like dude. six of us in the <laughs> movie fucking theater and like everybody left but uh, me and my boyfriend <laughs> i, I mean you gotta guys, stick yeah. it out at that point you gotta, oh my yeah. god it was right. the worst out of principle <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just got to finish. Like, I just Pull through. Get it. That's what you said. Yeah. That is. What, what, when, what month was That's last year, two yeah. years ago? I think that was the last movie I saw in theaters. I, say, I don't even remember the last movie I saw in theaters. Oh Do you guys remember the last I movie? I saw that theaters? Star Wars movie that I hated, so I've never gone back to the movie since then. <laughs> I don't think I've seen a movie since then. <laughs> I don't think I saw one like this year, even. Shit, in uh-uh. theaters? Uh, I saw Jurassic Park in theaters, the Man. newest one. I still haven't um, seen any of those new ones. Did everyone tell me Jurassic should. Parks? Yeah, I haven't seen them yeah, either. With it kind of makes. I don't know. It's just the originals, the original. Right. You know? Yeah. That's why I just kind it's of the only care. good one. Yeah. Star Wars. <laughs> Same. Yeah, yeah, I don't care. So it's the originals. Yeah. I don't it's get the originals. It, the Star Wars. So how it goes back in time, but it's like starts at the end, starts at the end, yeah. and then it. Yeah. You know. It is it a weird backwards. way to do it. It is a weird prequels. Way to do it. They were like kind of the first For sure. franchise to really do prequels, right? I mean, prequels existed, I'm sure, but like. He they definitely g- made prequels cool. He wanted to go That's punk fair. rock about it. He's yeah. like, I'm starting at the end. Yeah, yeah, right? <laughs> well, Darth Vader being such a huge figure, they right. wanted to get the origin Gotta story. Got to get the origin story. Yeah. yeah. You know, because the whole time you're like, I wonder what's going to happen. Yeah. Yeah. He's going to be Darth Vader someday. I wonder if Yoda's going to die in this scene. Right. Even though I've seen him in the subsequent films. <laughs> right, yeah. <laughs> like, right? You, do, you already know there's no stakes. Oh, my because, God, Anakin yeah. might die, even though he's Darth Vader. Yeah, right? yeah. Four, Obi-Wan five, Kenobi's in danger. Oh, no. Yeah, right? <laughs> oh, well. That's good. Pod racing. Yeah, but when you watch episode, Pod racing's cool. When That's you watch episode one cool. and, there's, and there's Liam Neeson as a Jedi, you're like, oh, he's probably going to die, right? <laughs> right, yeah. yeah. I don't Poor recognize Liam that Neeson. name at all. He's probably dead. Yep. <laughs> That's so, I, you know, I did like uh, the, what is it, the... On Disney like Mandalorian. Plus. Yeah, that was yeah. fun to watch. I like that. That is I a fun one. I didn't get through it all, but I also didn't keep it's trying. Coming back. It's way easier yeah. to digest. It's yeah. an hour. Yeah. It's an hour of short stories yeah. visiting yeah, part like, of the galaxy. It's always like a different story every week. I like too. that yeah. one. Yeah. yeah. That's fun. That was a fun one. I think the way Disney is doing their stuff now, like mm-hmm. TV series really suits how they're telling the stories. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. And big money behind that. That's f- it's uh, fucking Disney. John Favreau. Mm-hmm. John Favreau. I was not a fan of Mulan. Mulan? Oh, oh you didn't I, like I it? I heard a bunch of hate on Mulan. I never watched I it. I didn't see There's it. There's no Mushu, yeah. right? No. It's pork? It's like a flying bird or something. I don't know. Aww. No Mushu. Like, the things <laughs> that you would think that they would put in because of the cartoon. Yeah. Like, they made Mulan, like, spoiler alert, but. Whatever. They it's made Mulan. them, like, make her, like, flying and shit. Like, she can, like, walk on walls and she's some... Oh, they made it all Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon-y. Yeah, Yeah. but I didn't like that. I wanted it more like the original, you know? Yeah, it was great. Just because... I love the original. The original's awesome. Yeah, yeah. why well, you shouldn't deviate from the story, but yeah. you could just make things cooler. Yeah, right. <laughs> I was what? not a fan. Why well, you got to rewrite? I don't think rewrite. any. I don't think any of the Disney live action reboots have been good. No, no, no. not there've been like four or five now, and none of them. <laughs> yeah. I did good. like Maleficent though. That was good with Angelina. That's Lee. cool. I thought that was cool. That's cool because that's not really like a reboot. That's just kind yeah. of like a new take on it. Yeah, yeah. I like that. Mm-hmm. Um. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, Jungle Book, bad. Jungle uh, Book was b- shitty. I didn't even Lion see that King one. was Lion King was lame. Yeah. Aladdin was lame. Either. Beauty and the Beast. Beauty and the Beast was lame. There was live Dumbo. Aladdin. Yeah. He's Will Smith Dumbo? was a genie. Uh, Dumbo oh, was Dumbo. Bad? Mm. I didn't see that one. That one was different though, I think, because that's Tim Burton, right? Like it is. Did they take it's acid? It's a acid different one? story. Yeah, the story's Dumbo. different. Yeah. It's a different story um, of Dumbo, but it's still Dumbo. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think Lion King was bad. It just it wasn't bad. It was like why <laughs> it was interesting <laughs> sure not bad. enough to redo yeah like the first one is so you know what threw yeah. me off the most was 
Beyonce being not <laughs> And don't get me wrong, like I love her, Queen but B, the whole time I'm just like, I can see Beyonce talking. I wish it was yeah. somebody I didn't know. You she's know, oh, you actor. can see the face. Yeah, yeah. yeah. She's like, not a voice actor. Yeah, and her mm-hmm. voice is so recognizable. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that it takes you right out of it. Huh? She's not acting. She's talking like she's Beyonce. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. And, and nothing against her because she's great. But I was just like, yeah, I can't. It takes you right out. Yeah, yeah. that was the only it. thing that really pissed yeah. me off. And the whole time I was like, well, this sucks. <laughs> it kind of, I, you know, a I mean? little bit against Beyonce, and I, I'll go in. And <laughs> yeah. Someone, yeah. Someone's yeah. 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 All right. <laughs> so. So, can you feel the love tonight, right? Yeah. Like, oh. Nala doesn't really sing that much. She has very few lines of singing. She's got a verse. The entire, right. Yeah. You know. Yeah. She's, she's got a verse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, yeah. and it's just, like, it adds to the Did theme. Did she sing 64 notes she in three does. words? Yeah. <laughs> the king I see inside. Woo! Yeah. 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 You know? Just so much, yeah. and yeah. we did. No one asked for it. Mm-hmm. But she's Ellen should have come back and freaking, yeah. it should have been Rafiki singing or something. And yeah, you right? know, I don't know. I could see that more than Nala singing yeah. it. Yeah. Elton should have done all and of it. And as they're running across yeah. the plains just for some reason, the Beyonce song, Where is it? Pride Rock's over there. One more time with the Beyonce song? Spirit! Yeah. <laughs> no. Just not worth it, right? Yeah. Just not worth it. Yeah. Uh, probably the best. Actually, it was worth it. There's a lot of money in that movie. Yeah, <laughs> that movie made a lot of money. Uh huh. <laughs> Definitely. Um, speaking of Elton John, that was my last concert I saw oh. before. Ah, the that's a good one, though. Yeah, I saw his last concert in California. Or, yeah, California? At it was at the Honda Center. I think I was there. You guys might have gone to the same yeah. concert. Yeah. Yep. You guys went to the it same was concert. Wednesday. September 11th. That's all I remember. It was midweek. Yeah. 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 So rad, right? Yeah. So rad. <laughs> it was kind of interesting, though, because it was my sister's ex boyfriend bought her tickets. Ooh, awkward. And so they were supposed to go together, and she was like, eh, I probably shouldn't go. So I ended up buying the tickets from him, and then me and my sister went. Oh, oh fuck it. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Fair enough. But I think he gave me a good deal because he only. Char- like he only made me pay like two fifty or two hundred bucks. Like I'm pretty sure there were probably like four or six. Total. Okay, where were yeah. your seats? Were they good seats? Up like against the roof. Oh, yeah. <laughs> nosebleeds. But still, they yeah. were like. Yeah, I mean they're you know. Elton John oh my God, tickets. It was so yeah. much fun. That screen was fucking massive. Yeah, yeah. like that was a great. Sh- they, obviously, his band was unbelievable too. Oh yeah, oh, sure. My God. Yeah. As soon yeah. as they started playing Crocodile Rock, I about shit my pants. <laughs> 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 I think, I think my favorite part of Elton at, at like this age is final tour and shit, mm-hmm. right? Like final he would, tour. Right. He's doing like, uh, Crocodile Rock would be a huge fucking thing, right? But yeah. like, uh, uh, sorry seems to be the hardest word, yeah. right? And yeah. So sad, so sad. It's all, yeah. you know, and he says such a word. And then he just takes the top of the piano and just yeah. lifts it up a little bit and slams it down yeah. and stands up and yeah. just does this to the audience. Yeah. And uh-huh. they just lose it. That's awesome. Everyone just yeah. loses it, yeah. Yeah, it's, it was so much fun. As soon as the song's over. Yeah, just yeah. last note, bing, slam, up. <laughs> yeah. I love it. It's a good move. Yeah. <laughs> Are you not entertained? He can do whatever he wants. He's yeah. freaking Elton John. And you so, know? Yeah, yeah. Like, I think there was a time where someone didn't give him the reaction he was looking for, and he was doing this. He went back to the piano, slammed it again. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's hilarious. How dare you? Yeah, he was incredible. The most embarrassing so. thing for me is that my whole life, you're going to think I'm so dumb. Um, my whole entire life, I never knew that Norma Jean was. What's her name? Who cares? That's fine. It's so great. Song. Norma Jean. Jean. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, oh, that was Marilyn Monroe. Never yeah. knew that. My entire life. I never knew that. I didn't yeah. know that either. What? So, yeah. <laughs> uh, I knew it, but I, I didn't know. Yeah. yeah. That was. M- I'm uh, the dummy. I, I found that it. out because there was another band that came out called Norma Jean. And the then, band Norma Jean. And then I was like, "What band. the fuck is this for?" Yeah. And then I dived in, and then a whole thing, a the whole expose yeah. on yeah. Elton John guys, came up. I was like, "Ah, guys, all, oh, yeah. all three of you got to tell I never you. knew it was her. It's in the lyrics. Yeah. Is it? Okay. Is it? Yeah. Is it? Don't know the lyrics. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. it's, can- it's it's candle in the wind. It is. But. The first line is Combine all no my dreams. Not to be confused with Candle in Wind 1996 with yeah. Goodbye England's Rose, which is uh, Princess Diana. Yeah, yeah. of course. Old Diana. Yes, of Didn't course. know that at all. Yeah, <laughs> makes sense. <laughs> it was a re-record. Yeah, yeah. 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 Same yeah. song, just one line different. Oh no! It was a whole. Oh, yeah. oh, they, they changed the whole, yeah, the whole thing. Whole okay, good, good. Well, it's what you know. Oh yeah, Bernie wrote the words, right? Yeah, Bernie Toppin. Yeah, yeah. Bernie Toppin. Old Toppin. 
We got uh, one left. Should I get the we last one? We do have one, one left. Get, yeah, get just, the last just one. in case you don't want to get too. I need over. all four to like <laughs> taste one at a time. You know. I need all four to know that I've been through them. So. I got them in the wings. Uh, I got them in the wings. Yeah. And now it's Inca Cola. Yeah. And I'll, like, I've had this one before, and I can tell you it tastes straight good. from the Incans. That's what they say. This is probably the Ooh. inkiest. Peruvian. The inkiest of the ones that we've had. Inca Cola. Okay. Let's see. This is this one's bright only yellow. 140 calories. Okay, oh. low cal. Um, Less calories than the other. Descri- the golden carbonated beverage, <laughs> artificially and naturally flavored. The golden cola. The golden cola. Huh. Wait, is yours in English? Some is in English. Oh, oh just flip over. Oh, to oh. The other side. both sides. Both yeah, sides. Yeah. La nice. cola Dordana. <laughs> <laughs> I don't speak Spanish. Uh, produced for Fabricado para oh no okay uh, food and beverage Inc. Oh. Clifton, New Jersey. New Jersey. It smells like bubblegum. All right. Yeah, it's like, like, like bubblegum and maybe maybe cream soda. Wait, so is the is the yeah. is the taste of cola like maybe bubble gum? That must, in that must be the thing, right? Because it's yeah with a K, right? Weird. This one's yellow. This, this one, one, yeah, this one's like toxic waste colored. Ah, it's, it's yeah. golden. It's the golden yeah, yeah. cola. Yeah. The golden cola. Hmm. I don't know. Yeah. Um, I don't know what I feel anymore. I discovered this. When I went to Peru, all of Oliver's privilege. Oliver's corner. privilege corner. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I had an Inca Cola shirt for a while too. I lost huh. it. But I yeah. don't even know I what. Stuff. They all taste like bubble gum. Dude, they're, they, I think most. Of, I mean, they for all. Iron Man, or Iron Beer. Iron, Iron, Iron Beer. Man. This is a little closer to cream soda. I guess right? so. That's yeah. what I said. Maybe maybe I feel cream, like cream soda. Soda has a more of like a caramely. Yeah. Lighter. Or vanilla. It does kind of. I don't know. It all this tastes one like doesn't. Gum to me. It just. I think the color is what's tricking me. What a toss-up. Because I also feel like there could be like... So what's your favorite? I, I don't know. I think I still have to go with Iron Beer. Still going with the Iron Beer, I right? think this red one's my favorite. Milka. Milka. I got to go with Milka. Man. Okay. Headed yeah. back to Iron Beer. You know what I kind of need? What? It's like glasses of ice. Yeah. I can't totally agree with that. We do have ice in there. Oh, we have ice and we I know, have, uh, but I don't think we have 16 cups. 16? No. Well, wait, we could do... We, we, mean, you can mix. we can mix this shit. Just drink one. If and we're doing if we're one? doing scientific studies here, we need. <laughs> You're right. Cups. This is a lot of cross contamination. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I can't. You can't, I can't contaminate. soil yeah. Inca's good name. Fair enough. With iron beer, all right. Fair enough. Fair enough. Okay, so this one's Cuban, and w- one you said is Inca's Peruvian. Peruvian. Mm-hmm. Milka. I don't know where this one's from. Uh, Cuba for, for uh, that. Milka. Where is Milka from? Um. Um. I saw him in yeah, there. Boom, There's a whole bunch boom, of people in boom, there. Boom. <laughs> boom. It does not. It's not telling us. Nope. Sixty. Yeah, though. It is Spanish speaking. I think that's all we have on it. Yeah. Milka. <laughs> you got. Yeah, Colombiana is not really saying either. I feel like I might need an insulin <laughs> pump. Yeah, I think I might. Like <laughs> I know, right? There. Yeah, I'm um, about to finish. Any outlook for gigs in the holiday season? Um. Our calendars. Yeah. Dark. When, yeah, do, we when don't have do you anything. think we're coming back? I don't know. I the last two years I've played at the Avalon. Um, for the LGBT Center holiday party, which mm. is like huge, it's like the biggest show that we do um, every year for awesome. the last two years. And actually, I got that gig from doing Raw. Wait, is Avalon by my house in HB? Um, LA. LA. Avalon is across is it, from Capitol Records. Is there another Avalon too? Uh, Maybe it's because there's another big old uh, like gay bar that's like the size of like half a Walmart. Might be a chain. Maybe it's know. a chain. Hamburger no, but Avalon is Avalon's a big ass. Thing. How, well, how many people go to have? I don't know. Um, I don't know. A lot. Yeah. yeah. I'm just I'm trying to think of the capacity there. To Something popped up on your screen billion. over there. I don't know. Oh, it's just oh. telling me to update. Do something. <laughs> yeah, don't worry about it. <laughs> yep, as long as it's cruising, we're fine. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're still recording. <laughs> so is that happening this year? I don't know. I haven't yeah. reached out to them yeah. yet just because like it's a lot of people. Sure. Um, right. Like, so that's always a really fun one to do because they have it's just cool because like when you walk in it's like the Beatles play there like a week before we played like um oh my god what's the band that the singer from Blink 182 joined which one uh, Angels and Airwaves yeah, yeah they played like a week before we yeah, were there, there and go. I was just like oh just to be on the same stage as like all these other amazing bands like it's awesome Fuck cool. you know even if it's just for a holiday party it's like when people are dancing and having a good time for what you're doing yeah that's like the best feeling. Right. Of course. You know? That's all that matters. But to answer your question, no. I do not <laughs> have anything lined up except at Hennessy's Bar in Laguna outside. When? I am playing November 14th, November 14th. and November 29th. Hell yeah. Okay. Yeah. 
This will be out before then, I think. Yeah. So go yeah. see her. Down in Laguna? Yeah. Yeah. Laguna Beach is yeah, yeah. Laguna. great yeah. spot. Yeah. 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 Come out so we don't have to play to the pigeons. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> it's been a little chilly, so bring your coat. <laughs> 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 There's heaters, but, you know. They are not having live music inside yet, so yeah. it's just yeah. outside. I don't think anyone really is. Yeah, Wave First yeah. is the same thing, right? Just a little back area. Mm-hmm. They're, they're back part. Are they having shows now. there yet? They're doing it's like cover once a band week. Thing. Yeah, they're having um, OC Sellout guy came in and did like a DJ set and right. stuff like that. They're doing little stuff. Cool. Yeah, if cool. you guys nice. want a, another gig, 200 bucks for four hey, hours. Hey, let's I talk. I give them your info. Let's talk. <laughs> let's talk. Yeah, let's yeah, let's talk. talk. I mean, the three of Honestly, us. Honestly, yeah. it's like a super chill gig, and it's really yeah. fun. The guy who works the bar, Scott, shout out to him. He's awesome. Shout out, Scott. And uh, he is so cool, and, you know, it's really laid back, fun, just, you I think, know. I think Glass Radio was telling us to book there. A bunch of people. Uh, yeah. What's Special, the place called again? Hennessy's. Hennessy's. Okay. Yeah, yeah. They have, like, a whole bunch of locations, um, but all the locations that I know of aren't, they all do live music, except I think Laguna's the only one that's doing it right now, just because yeah. of covid and everything right, right. um but man last time we played like we literally sat there and just like rehearsed new songs just because there was nobody there. yeah it's like open <laughs> open practice basically yeah, and yeah. we were like doing we were like okay let's find a whole bunch of old rock songs that we want to do so he was doing like we were doing crazy uh, cra- yeah, crazy, crazy train, train. Crazy yeah, train. Yeah, yeah. yeah so we were like practicing that and we were just practicing like layla and just like a whole bunch yeah. of weird, like, old rock cool. songs and Great. just trying to like New, That's awesome. Learn some new material. Hey, yeah. why not? That's. I mean, we do that a lot too. Is if we we're bored on stage, we'll challenge we ourselves. Li- with we literally new. let yeah. anyone like call out a song. And yeah, we, we take requests. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I always say we take requests, but I can't guarantee you we can do it. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah. I just tell them this. I go. I go. We we'll, we'll play any song, but if it's bad. It's your fault. <laughs> it's your fault for requesting it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's what like, is the that guy worst right there song the red hat. <laughs> you've ever had to like play that someone requested? Well, the Any worst B-side. song or the song we did the worst? Ooh, um, both. Both? Okay. Because uh, I don't know which one I choose. The song we did the worst I know is ABBA. And the yeah, ABBA was terrible. Because, because my mom said, don't do ABBA anymore. Oh, my God. That's, <laughs> that's hilarious. My mom saw it. Wait, which one? Like, was it Dancing Queen? Dancing Queen. Yeah. 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 I mean, come on. What, 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 and my, what mom's a mu- well, my mom's a super harsh critic, though. So, you know. That's the, that's the one that I know we did the worst. Yeah. Because my mom said so. Because yeah. I remember that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you were to if you were to ask me from memory, no, we have train we've, wrecked. We've train wrecked and murdered so everything else. So many yeah. songs. Yeah, that's that, hilarious. Yeah. Uh, uh, do we suck at Blink One Eighty Two? Every Blink One Eighty Two song, Craig and I could not do. Yeah, Oliver. Knows I know all of them because <laughs> Travis Parker's my boy. But yeah. Yeah. I don't know why that shit doesn't come out right ever because it sucks. Yeah, it's and too easy. <laughs> I guess I don't know. <laughs> A lot of those know. easy ones too. We fuck up. Yeah, you just overthink it, and you're like, yeah. oh, it's. Yeah, there's no, an it's extra here. note in here. Yeah, yeah. It's here. It, All right. Yep, power chords. Better dude. luck next time. <laughs> yeah. That's yeah. hilarious. I don't uh, think we can. We can't do like requests if someone asks. Like we can't. I don't know. The band isn't like. It's probably how many it's, instruments you have too. Yeah, like, it's yeah. a lot we harder have to arrange. Ultimate yeah. guitar tab thing on our phone. Yeah. So as long as we're both on the same page. Yeah, and then we're just looking page. at it. Yeah. You yeah. just hit auto scroll and play whatever the fucking we've, notes are above the words. We've kind of been forced into it over time. You know, when you do like private gigs and by the end of it. Mm-hmm. And you're hour, out of songs. You know, yeah. Like there's an hour left and everyone's real surly and they're just yelling things at you. So you're like, you know what? Fuck, Fuck it. it. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Warpigs? Warpigs? Warp- All right. Warpigs was fun though. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. We had go last time we played some dude just like paid us like a hundred bucks. Yeah, gave, gave us a hundred dollar bill. Was that Ray? To sing it. No, no. Oh. It was uh, Shout out Ray. <laughs> Ray would Ray. Uh, Ray, give us a hundred bucks, we'll let you we sing. Need to get, we need to get him on. Anyway. Yeah, we yeah. should get him on here. Yeah. Uh, yeah, no, he gave us a hundred bucks to sing it, and then we just let him on stage, oh and God, he did it for so us. Yeah, he, he nailed it. He, he, he really nailed good. it too. Yeah. He had, like perfect character voice for it. Yeah, yeah. We oh, didn't want to so sing cool. it. Yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> yeah. manager at the end of the night was like, "Guys, really lucked out with that Aussie guy, huh?" Yeah, <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. right? Sounds great. Could have gone the way band. worse. <laughs> yeah, could have gone way worse. <laughs> really could have. It has. He, before. he was it like an old Hispanic guy. Oh yeah, he in was like all in. in like a flannel button up. Yeah, I think he had like a Motorhead hat or something yeah, like yeah. that. Yeah, yeah. Funny. Ozzy in his hat. eyes. Yeah, yeah, he was ready to go. If yeah. people hit you up, do they want to know like what type of style you sing, or would they want to see a set list? Because people want to see a set list, and I'm like, we're super no. word of mouth. Oh, it's so like, we well, we're word of, super word of mouth, and also like they they don't feel like they can request things until a few songs in anyway so they've gotten like until an idea until we tell them yeah that oh, we also yeah, don't have too. a set list oh, I think were you talking yeah, about we don't really use, we yeah, talking we about, about set list. venue mm-hmm. bookings 
like do they want to see a set list for like a venue and just like it? if you like do a wedding or if, if you do a party oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. like a special yeah, spe- that- like a specific type of venue I see or what something. you're saying we have like yeah. a master list or Craig's yeah. master list of like everything we could do yeah. uh, but yeah. a lot of the time we're getting these things from people seeing mm-hmm. us at a brewery yeah, or yeah, doing for, it sure. for the cover thing I see what you're saying yeah. so mm-hmm. that's how we end up getting it through through those avenues <laughs> and they, they know three piece rock band like we're not going to come in here and do like Celine Dion yeah. in you know a bunch we don't of have a string stuff. section yeah. it's also yeah. totally different like yeah. if we play if we play midday Sunday brewery it's acoustic right and yeah. The, yeah. the hottest we're gonna get is Sweet Caroline right Sweet like that's, Caroline. Right? I mean, bah, 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 right and then people are yeah. drunk with beers but if we're doing Temecula on a on a Halloween Saturday night yeah it's gonna get wild that's and we're a good time. Like, Motley Crue you got it you know yeah. like yeah. so mm-hmm. it's just uh Reading yeah. the room, yeah, I guess. Super reading the room, reading room. but luckily yeah. we have like ta- we, we, uh, the tab thing makes it. They'll let you know. Amount. We have the like, internet. Yeah. They'll let you know because you play yeah. Johnny Cash and everyone's mm-hmm. right here crushing it, and then you move to Take on Me and they they leave. They're gone. Yeah. You're like mm-hmm. okay, all right. so that was not the That's right like one. My yeah. favorite song, I'll Take on. <laughs> It's a good oh, song. It's so take great. It's a great song. Oh, and in the right room, it crushes. Yeah, but in the wrong room, you're like. All right, let's not do that. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, so yeah. steer no, away from the 80s. No yeah. more new wave tonight. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's going to be... In a day or two. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's my go-to every time. It's a good That's one. That's it. Do you cover that live? Uh, No. Oh, I've never should. tried it. Just oh, go for it. Do it. You it's got fun. it. Yeah. It's a dude singing. Yeah, it's a dude. <laughs> I freaking love it. You know what song I love to sing and my band hates to perform? Yes. What? Social Distortion. No, not that one. Apologize. It's um, Smooth by Rob Thomas. Oh, oh it's such a great song, though. Yeah. But it's three chords. Mm. Dun, dun, like yeah. the whole time, so yeah. they're probably really bored of it. Yeah. Your I don't know. <laughs> your guitar, your guitar player probably loves it. Yeah, I love Rob Thomas. He's right? a shit yeah. Dude. yeah. My guitar players kill that song, yeah. so yeah. it's like super yeah. good joke. Oh, he Santana's it out? Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. God, good stuff. It's under the moon. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's the same as the emotion that <laughs> <laughs> I get from you. Get from you. Yeah. It's a good one. Yeah, we, yeah, we play. We, it's so crazy because my set list, it'll go from like, Nine to five, Dolly Parton to like smooth, and then like I wish Stevie Wonder or something. Uh, nice, and then like it just it's random. There's no like thought process. It's just like okay, we're gonna do this. Okay, we're gonna do that. <laughs> do you have a list or or we have a list, yeah. and then I end up switching it during yeah. the show, which they probably all get mad at, but whatever. <laughs> <laughs> no, just it's what just the like, crowd is. You yeah, know? yeah, it's yeah. like okay, we gotta do. I will survive right now because everyone's dancing. Like I don't like to take a break, no. and I don't like Dude, to like this guy refuses cancel. to take breaks. Yeah. Unless like we're trying to build time, like I'm like okay, I point to everybody. I'm like okay, guitar solo, sax solo, guitar solo again, yeah. drum solo. And I'm just fucking time. pointing like, yeah, yeah. everywhere. Like you have no idea. That's how it goes. Sixteen, sixteen. Yeah, yeah. Keep going. All right, stop right here. You're at the bar. You're just like yeah. And then everyone's looking like, what the fuck is she doing? <laughs> Shaking a margarita. I know. Sixteen. Sixteen. One more time. Bam, 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 bam. All right, this isn't where we're gonna stop. But we're gonna stop right here. I, yeah, we've had some fun times. That's great. Yeah. yeah. It's always a good time. Yeah, Craig does not take breaks. Yeah, he refuses. I'm, I'm getting paid. I'm taking a fucking break. Yeah. Yeah, and I, yeah. I still treat it like I still treat it like a server thing. Yeah. Um, if if uh, if I'm solo acoustic, mm-hmm. absolutely no breaks. Absolutely mm-hmm. no breaks. I'm gonna do four hours straight through because it, the time that I'm not singing, someone is not tipping me, and I, I no. want them to hear a song and yeah. come up and give me twenty bucks. Yeah. So I'm just a little obsessed with That's it. That's awesome. Yeah. 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 We like uh, we took a lot of breaks this last gig because <laughs> there was nobody there. Yeah. <laughs> so we were Good. just like, screw it. We're gonna practice, and we'll. All right, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. All right, yeah. I'm gonna. You know, when there was nobody there, right. but we used right. it. You know. We still performed, you know. Sure, of course. Yeah, there, um, we take like on a four-hour set two breaks. Yeah, maybe, maybe <laughs> for if like it, ten if minutes. If it's yeah. a great time, then we just yeah. don't break. But yeah, if yeah, if it's if going real, if we're well, playing we for break, the yeah. Republican Party on a horse ranch in Marietta, yeah, I'm gonna take a break because the guy. I think that's, we did a ten there, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And mm-hmm. he just, you even took a break. Yeah, yeah. He, did. he literally talked to us about. Republican videography the whole break. Yeah, yeah. It yeah, was like, was all right, Craig, you want to go back and play? Yeah, like, I, I'm like the Republican <laughs> yeah, videographer like, we, for like, I knew Jeffrey Epstein <laughs> and shit. Oh my God. Yeah. Awesome. Want to see a picture of me and Don Jr.? I'm like, <laughs> shout out I want to go yeah. play. Yeah. Probably killing it, buddy. I'm going to yeah. go play some music right now. Yeah. 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 Um, I hope you like my song. <laughs> <laughs> I've been trying do you to do like, a rap. Yeah, do, you like, <laughs> do you like music? Oh my gosh, that's hilarious. Oh. Yeah. So, I mean, we take, I mean, if like, uh, 
the holiday parties that we play at, they will do a talk, speeches or whatever, and mm. they'll like have people oh, come yeah, up. Oh yeah, So stuff. it's like those are like the breaks that Built we plan breaks, for, which yeah. is yeah, which is I love. You know? I wish we had those. Yeah, yeah. built-in breaks. I mean the. Yeah. Yeah. Well, the thing is, just, we uh, the places that have them are usually when we do weddings, and then they right. make us do the fucking MC <laughs> shit. <laughs> yeah. you know, All crazy, right, though, we need the father of the bride coming yeah. into the center room here. Yeah, it's well, you have a perfect table voice three, for that. Table yeah. three, table three. You really do though. You yeah. have like a voice actor like uh, it's voice. All, it's just like up and down. It's very yeah. sporadic. It's very. I took uh, voiceover classes volatile. for like a year, <laughs> you, and you have like that voice for it. There you go. Oh, get into broadcasting, on, dude. Dempsey. Let's get yeah, yeah. Some yeah. Money. I stopped yeah. taking money. classes when they wanted me, at, or when we started taking. Um, when they sent you to the Scientology dialects. building. No, <laughs> when they started teaching dialects, because I just oh, couldn't do it. Yeah. Oh. I want my coffee, you know my, you know yeah. that's as good as I got, you know. Coffee. I'm Irish. I. They said okay. They will give you like a scenario, like a character, and they want you to put the dialect with it, and they were yeah. like, be a Irish space battle galactica warrior and i'm like what the hell oh i sounded like God. a pirate i was like ire like you know like, like, you know, like, Arr, like i don't know I, 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 Arr, i'm like i don't freaking know what i'm doing i was better at the commercials that's so good that's great yeah irish space battle i like that yeah irish i don't even know battles. it was weird <laughs> yeah well i'm just now i'm just trying to think yeah, how do you do oh, it? Oh, Lord, we're so close to the sun, my potatoes could yeah. cook right here inside me. Yeah. 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 See, I couldn't do that. I would be like, Arr. like that's, that's all I got. Pew, pew, See, I only, and I can I go full Scottish because of Scotty. That's like, I'm giving it all she's got, Captain. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, And a little Liverpool. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it defaults yeah. to the Beatles. Yeah, the Beatles. That's and hilarious. <laughs> yeah, you guys got that down. <laughs> <laughs> I seriously stood up there and I was like, I don't even know what to do. And you're in front of your class and you're just like, Oh, that sucks. Uh, right. Yeah. Arr, super arr, 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 arr. The ship. I don't freaking know. Like. <laughs> I, I'm in space. I, I, I'm, in, I'm in space. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, no. I found myself in space. Arr. Arr. <laughs> yeah. Not again. From Ireland. Arr. That was fun. That was a good time. That sounds awesome. Uh, plan, uh, what's the plan for new music? When's the, when did the last chunk of music come out? You, s- you said those songs are old, old? Yeah, all those songs. I have seven right now. Yeah. Um, I think. Do you have a favorite platform to push people to? Is it Spotify, YouTube? It's is on it? everything. Okay. I have it on YouTube. I have it on Spotify. Do you have a favorite place to go where you um, check the most? If they're trying to come in your back or something? I'd probably say Spotify. Probably okay. the most just because, I mean, what? That's probably the most popular thing right That's now. That's what everyone does. I've That's what everyone $65 does. dollars yeah. in the last five years Woo! off of streaming. Hell yes! yeah. Yes! Woo! Just saying. Pennies. Yeah. And I paid like six thousand dollars, so whoop, we're yeah. almost there. Fractions of point pennies. one Fractions percent. Yeah. Almost yeah. there, you guys. Yeah. Yeah, uh, almost balanced. Don't out. feel too bad. The only thing that actually has like plays on our Spotify is owned by a record label, so we haven't made any money. Yeah, really? yeah. <laughs> yeah. So <laughs> all of our Spotify proceeds so go. So the back record to that. label paid for you guys to record type of thing. No, nope. no, no. They just they fronted money for PR. for PR. So we, yeah. we did a publicity campaign mm-hmm. when the record came out, mm-hmm. uh, which was great. Which is great. We actually needed Helped the yeah. We needed the Google search rankings. We yeah. were getting crushed yeah. by Keanu Reeves and Keanu Sandbook. Reeves. Yeah. Um, and the film speed. Yeah, so then it, it boosted that huge. It got put mm-hmm. onto a Spotify playlist, yeah. and it was kind of worth it. It didn't yeah. pay for itself. No, but yeah. we're yet. still paying for it. Yeah, yeah, yet. Waiting for that. Yeah. Three year later surge where right. they all just get so many. Plays. <laughs> I just paid for all my like, we're gonna the recording be and everything, and just I paid for it all. So it's yeah. like I own it. It's like I have the master copies to everything. Yeah, which cool. is good. But still, I'm just like, gotta get out there. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. At it's some a hustle. point, it's a if if you have the possibility to, like, let a record label put money into your shit, just realize you're going to write more music. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So if you if, right. don't be tied to it, this isn't your life's yeah. work in seven fucking songs. Yes. Yeah. Like, oh no, you, for you can, sure. That's why we're just like we signed it and just like. I don't care. Yeah, let's write the we're, next record. We got, yeah. we got more music <laughs> coming out. Yeah. Like, it's, a, you, it's all right. You want to put this out? Great. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You have yeah. it. You take care of it. We yeah. were going to, but yeah. if you yeah. want to. We definitely like, didn't have whatever money they put into us to no. do the PR at oh, all. Yeah, so yeah. Like, to have I think that my was stuff's pretty buzzing. good, but like, I just don't, I wouldn't know. How, I don't have the connection. I don't have the connection for that yet. Yeah. It wasn't even a connection We don't either. It was PR, you can get. 
you, without yeah. knowing yeah, anyone. Yeah, just I mean, look for look for things in your genre yeah. and hit up some smaller firms. Um, you know, some of them will do single campaigns for like fifteen hundred, mm, but they'll you know they'll get you magazines and they'll get you e zines and oh, you know cool. and do what they can yeah. for you. Yeah. But yeah. careful, it's mm-hmm. dime a dozen with scoundrels out there. Yeah. yeah. So um, you find reputable to, ones that have yeah. artists. Just, that yeah, you check play. some track look records. Look at their roster. Yeah. Yeah, you know, sure. and yeah. make sure that it's comparable. Because mm-hmm. um, yeah. we were already going to look at PR firms before. Mm-hmm. For um, off- AGR, label. yeah. Any yeah, before commercial before work did you guys get, like song placements or anything? Fuck God, no. no, we wish. Yeah, I know that's the next step. We, we probably really wouldn't want. be. This here. girl I know <laughs> had a placement on Young and the Restless, I think, and Great. it was oh, like it wasn't even chopped up. It was like the full like minute cool. and a half song. There you I was go. like, girl, you get it. Yeah, that's awesome. It was really awesome. I'm like, I have a song that I wrote called Delicious, and I'm like, that needs to be on a freaking cookie commercial or like food. I'm like, come on. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that, we just need to be sucks, in a car commercial or a beer commercial or yeah, something. Yeah, what sucks is there's yeah. a dime a dozen licensing companies. That yeah. too. And yeah. only like a half of 1% actually have the feelers with the commercials. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah. Otherwise, you're just having people... Plus, they're like, already in bed with major record labels yeah, already. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. So, like, the, the little boutique guys you find is like, do you want to be on that mattress commercial yeah. over there in South Carolina? I'll for take a month? whatever I can get. <laughs> yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? Absolutely. It's like, yeah, I'll for just sure. goddamn mailbox. My scenario yeah, hasn't yeah. even been offered to me. I wish yeah. it was. Yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> I would take it. But there's, I, I, I say it all the time. There's like a million ways to skin the cat in yeah. the music yep. biz, yeah. right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. And so just we're doing a podcast, and we're a band. <laughs> yeah. Remember yes. how we're a band? <laughs> <laughs> but this <laughs> is fun, though. This yeah, is, yeah. you know, this is a good time. This is another way to get yourself out there. But totally, know. we yeah. originally, but it's fun. we originally did this just so that we could catch up because we mm-hmm. spent a lot of time at practices yeah. talking. Yeah. So we would yeah. spend like an hour like guys, fucking we have to talking. Time the set. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We have to yeah. play at some point tonight. So this helps us just like at some point we don't talk throughout the week just so yeah. we can get our yayas out here. Yeah. <laughs> and, then, oh, and then actually work on music afterward. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I'm always the talker. I'm like, how was your day? Oh, great. There's so many. That's <laughs> like, I like to, blah, 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 I like to re- vet my day to my buddies. Yeah. I was, yeah. Get off my fucking chest. Do like, you sure. know what happened today? Right. Freaking Beth. Dracula. I'm sorry. <laughs> Beth Dracula. Beth, <laughs> Beth Dracula. Beth Dracula. Dracula. <laughs> they were fucking on top of the ants. Who the heck's name is Dracula? <laughs> that guy. Uh, this guy. Dude, he, yeah. For he had real, a though? Like, it's well, like his, his name? actual name? Oh, no. He... He, uh, well, he goes by Count Dracula, <laughs> yeah. but his oh. friends. <laughs> but he literally, like D. he came Count. up and wanted to <laughs> rent a truck, and yeah. then I was like, what's your name? And he's like, Dracula, and I was like, sure, buddy. <laughs> I would have died. So then I'm like, what's your address? And he's like, I'm not going to give you that. And I'm like, well, you can't have a fucking truck. And I'm like, do you have a driver's license? He's like, no. And I'm like, then you can't drive. You can't rent a truck, <laughs> dude. Name? He's like, Dracula? He's like, you're supposed to be fucking helping me. And then my boss was next to me, and he's like, why don't you just make like a bat and carry your shit over there, dude? <laughs> <laughs> and then he left. I would have died. I would have yeah. been like, um, sure, let me get your... I don't even know. That's the Chris Dawson. Hey, man, you should <laughs> that is a just turn into a fucking Throw bat some garlic at him. Fly over there, dude. Oh, yeah. my God. Yeah. That's hilarious. He's like, 666 Vampire Drive, yeah. Transylvania. Yeah. He just was <laughs> some like, he's got to be on drugs. Oh, HB yeah. bro, Huntington, white dude. Huntington Beach, me- math. Yeah, thinks is, that he, yeah. you know, yeah. you don't need to know my name or where I live. I just need a fucking truck. It's like... All I'm saying is that you're yeah. you're really lucky you didn't get attacked and your blood sucked out of you. Well, why don't if you're gonna say your name's Dracula, why don't you just say like I'm at 19 Castlevania Way? Dude. Yeah, right. You know, yeah. like unit. There's so a, many jokes dude. you can make. Yeah, yeah why not just keep great. going? Got to commit to the bit. Yeah. yeah. Uh, when we were playing on Tuesday, this guy came come up to us and he was a homeless guy and I play for the homeless a lot. And uh, yeah, because voluntarily yeah. or because yeah. no, just because that's all to, who's yeah. around. And you know what? Everybody deserves to have some music. You know? Sure, of course. And it makes yeah. them happy. And they knew all the songs that I was singing, so it's good. Yeah. But he was like, "I'm the Bird Man," and I was like, "What?" And the other day, I was like, "What was his name again?" I bird thought it was man. Bird Cage, and no. Yeah. And then my, my boyfriend was like, "No, it was the Bird Man." And I'm like, "Okay, the Bird Man." So the Bird Man, like every time I played his song, he'd be like, "Do you have this?" And I'm like, "No, but I got this." And he's like, "Okay." And then he would look at me and be like. <gasps> oh. <laughs> <laughs> and then he would like shake his head and then out of his pocket falls a bottle of like crown <laughs> and like by the end of the night it was gone but yeah. just his like expressions he'd be like oh yeah, oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> number like, one fan he would just like look up his expressions were the same he'd go <gasps> <laughs> just like I don't know, it was funny. Schizophrenia is yeah. awesome. Yeah, yeah. But they always come up weird names like the Birdman, yeah. Dracula, Dracula yeah. you know. Yeah. Hercules maybe there, next. I don't know. Yeah. That's how a, they're known on the streets. Yeah. Yeah, There's yeah. one uh, bum by me that's uh he has a bunch of trash bags wrapped around him and then a trash bag 
like head <laughs> thing and then he's got head piece yeah he's yeah. got he's got one piece of metal that goes out and then it's one little mirror and he just walks around <laughs> all crazy like dude. <laughs> yeah he literally walks around in, in like a fucking trash bag <laughs> turban wow. and like a, a jesus outfit oh dude of trash bag right. it's Hang the up. best another reason i love southern california yeah, yeah. i yeah. think he can do it so he, he <laughs> can just really pee and no one can see it dude <laughs> oh my God, just, just change your bag he's just like a change slug yeah. just like a slug walking around uh, <laughs> just shit behind wait him. until he hilarious. turns into a butterfly it's gonna happen he's gonna, you know, <laughs> <laughs> he's gonna fly he hatches away. in a donald Trump. He's, got, he's got two <laughs> mirrors for antenna i worked at a breakfast restaurant for a really long time and um this lady came in and she sat at a table and it was kind of earlier in the morning so there wasn't really anybody there and i was like hi what can i get for you and she was like oh i'm just looking right now can i just have some water i'm like sure totally normal and all of a sudden i heard and jesus is going to kill us all and i'm like what is happening right now it was literally normal and then i had another table come in and they moved to the other side of the restaurant yeah i would too because they were super scared and this lady is literally talking about like hiller she's like in the devil and just like crazy shit and to like, herself yeah wow and i go over to her and i'm like are you doing okay she's like yeah i'm fine i'm like what the fuck is going on right now she didn't have tourette's no, she no, just, just was like a homeless. And just, I've seen her walking on the streets uh, okay. before, and yeah, yeah. like Mental not to talk issues. bad about like homeless people or anything. Sure. I don't want that, but you know what yeah. I mean. Like, well, shout out homeless people. They're watching. They're All watching. the homeless people so watching this. They have YouTube. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. but you know what they're I mean. Like, you. it was just like, whoa, what is happening? I was not. Expecting yeah, we don't have a sure. homeless issue. We have a mental health issue. Yeah, we sure do. That's, That's yeah. a homeless yeah. issue would be solved by giving someone a home. And if you give a person with mental health issue a home, they're going to just be right back on the streets. Yep. Yeah. yeah, or yeah, yeah. be drawing on their walls until they lose the house. Destroying then, their house, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then you back know, on the street. It's just crazy because like I was thinking about it. I was trying to figure out like I was doing real estate. I was trying to take real estate classes because I don't know. Smart in money. this area. Why not? I yeah, just, I'm like I want to be able to make Flip my own houses. schedule yeah. and yeah. then like be a musician. You know, obviously right. the musician is the goal, but I'm like if I can get out of the service industry and just try to like be, be my own boss. You yep. know, right? Yeah. And in other states, it's just crazy. Like, none of us could afford a house freaking out here. Oh, no. no. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. Good God, like, no. I'm like, I want to yeah. buy a house where my boyfriend's family lives. And I'm like, if I were to buy a house, I could afford, mm, it would be a box. Yeah. yeah. With, like, it'd be this room. It'd be, yeah, yeah <laughs> half the size of this room <laughs> with no roof and no yeah. toilet, yeah. probably. Because yeah. it would, no you know. <laughs> there, it's just in. in I don't know. It's, well, insane. It's, it's insane. Location, location, location. Yeah, we're, yeah. From, we're from Michigan. My mom's house is like huge, and it sells for like a hundred thousand dollars. Huge yeah. mansion, beautiful. No, not right? huge yeah. mansion, but it's three bedroom, two bath on like an acre lot with like yeah. three car garage yeah. and a yeah. log cabin in the back for kids with cable yeah. and a, ha- a pool. You can buy anything <laughs> out there, and I can't yeah. afford yeah. it. But this is where we want to be, right? Supposedly, I can't Absolutely. afford a house. He can't afford a house. Good my, house. My Great parents, house. My parents can afford a house. Oh, he doesn't. Uh, my dead house. uncle. Yeah, my dead uncle bought me a house. Oliver's privilege. Oliver's privilege. Cool. Cool. Shout out, uncle. Yeah, shout out, uncle yeah, Ed. You're dead. You're dead. <laughs> but he's watching. He's, he's watching. watching. He's That's watching. Nice. He's watching. This one's watching. for you. Yeah. <laughs> this house did you for a, you. Did you get the uh, roommate uh, spot filled? It's done. Yeah, it's done. He's moving in. So full capacity. You guys all live together, right? Right. No. 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 <laughs> you God, no. right there. Everyone just know. Yeah, God. Oh, no. No. On that last podcast, <laughs> yeah. you guys did. I thought. Uh, I no, no. With him forever. Dave lived together oh, I forever. Lived, yeah. yeah. Uh, Scientology. Sean. Uh, yeah. Sean lives with me. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. I don't know. For some reason, I thought you guys oh, yeah. all lived together. I've never uh, lived with Oliver. Nope. So maybe we've been on tour together. Probably during that podcast, we yeah, <laughs> talked <laughs> about a, uh, in the past. Craig and I and Sean mm-hmm. and another guy lived all together. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so it's probably you probably just caught a snippet of what oh, we're okay. talking I about. I thought I heard something. like, yep. Oh, you guys all we did. Together. We no. did all live with him. And he went on tour with us and shit too. So yeah, definitely lots of history and living together. Yeah, they've known each other for fucking ever. Oh wow, that's yeah. awesome. Yeah, but uh, <laughs> nope. Yeah, I, 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 yeah, like I said, dead rich uncle bought me a house and awesome. and now I live in Anaheim. And wow, that's awesome. Yeah, we're gonna turn my garage into a studio and get this. out of this room. That's. Perfect. Ideally. Let's cut some tracks, eh? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Come Let's on over and record it. when it's yeah. when it's God, up and running. We should collab on something. Are you yes. Down or maybe? Yeah. We always know. we of always course. need we always need yeah. female vocals in like all our songs. So. Yeah, we had I'm to there. we had to hire someone for the last time. Yep. Okay, you don't even have to hire me. I'll Woo! just show up. Yeah. <laughs> we'll hold you I to might it. Look at the harmonies the first time, but the second or third time I should. None be of right. us do. None of us do. We're making them up as we go. So. Since my baby left, since my since my baby I go. <laughs> Do, re, mi, 
do me do me or whatever. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. We don't do that. <laughs> we, don't we go on we're like, ah, does that sound good? No. <laughs> nope. No. Bah! <laughs> 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 I'm like, yeah, that's that's. You're getting closer. That You're getting, <laughs> just close I, your throat just, up. Just, yeah, yeah. Just don't. One, one more time. Ready and go for it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that was it. That yeah. was perfect. It was great. Perfect. Yeah, that was perfect. We'll just fix it. Here's some audio yeah. auto tune. It just comes out like, beep. <laughs> Sweet. Okay. I'm trying to think. I think I had one more. I had a question for you. Oh. Um, what's your favorite like classic rock song? Oh God. That's Does impossible. Hey Jude count? Sure. Sure. That's it. Uh, hey Jude. Yeah. I'm a sucker. Yeah. Probably I've, what the weight. Wait, that's a good one. That's a good one. Uh, I, love, I love me the band. Fuck. I don't that know. or Ophelia by the band also. Mm. I don't know. This is too hard. Okay. <laughs> or it's Highway to Hell. I mean, yeah. Highway I'm to hell. on the highway yeah. to hell. Yeah. I just love the snare in that. Yeah. <laughs> the most I was just curious. Yeah, I, uh, I mean, the whenever someone asks me favorite song, I just say something by the Beatles. The song mm-hmm. something. Uh I mean, it doesn't but have I am to be your, guy too. I mean, yeah. I guess not favorite because when people ask me that, I'm like, I yeah. don't freaking know because I have so many. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, The Who. You know? Let's go with yeah. uh, like uh, The Real Me by The Who. Yeah. Kind of depends cool on what line. mood I'm in. Yeah, exactly. It changes. Mm. You asked the question. Yeah, I know. You know? <laughs> it's really weird because a lot of people don't like, from my experience, like a lot of people don't like the Eagles, but I freaking oh, sure. love the Eagles. Oh, and I freaking, yeah, just because I, mean, I like listening to like, their harmonies and stuff they do. Millions of records aren't wrong. So like, you know, and Great I would arms. say like March, my favorite song in that segment of time was like, uh, well, I was running down the road, trying to lose my load. I guess. You know, yeah. so that one was Shout one. Shout out Glenn Frey, you know, he's dead. Yeah. He's dead. Uh, dead. You know, <laughs> Creedence he's Clearwater, like, I got some yeah. going on there. Like, yeah. I don't know, Creedence it just depends best, on what yeah. mood I'm in, you know? Your classic rock roots are so pronounced. Yeah, it's yeah. definitely a classic thing. <laughs> no. What's the What's the most like... New. I mean, we were before we started. We yeah. were like rocking out about like yeah. You said Offspring and Taking Back Sunday and Yellow yeah. Card and shit. Mm-hmm. So, so like wh- these days. Stomach, did you hear that? My stomach like <laughs> was like tossing it. From the <laughs> it's the it cola. Like, it's definitely yeah, it's cola. Like, I'm, I'm definitely feeling the the sugar buzz for yeah. sure. Yeah. I think <laughs> I need some more red. <laughs> <laughs> red bone? No iron Getting beer. Down on some red. Yeah. Uh, red so bone. of of like the newer rock stuff. What mm-hmm. are you still listening to? What do you gravitate Back, towards? Yeah, yeah of like more Current contemporary stuff. Yeah. Yeah. It doesn't even have to be rock. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The guitar player um, that I work with, his name's AJ. He's in the Shout metal band. Yeah, he's pretty dope. Mm-hmm. He's really dope. Um, he sings a lot of like in his repertoire. He has like a lot of like Blink One Eight Two, Green Day, um, yeah. Sublime, and that kind of s- vibe. Okay. And so because of that, I've learned a lot. And it kind of like I've been doing like a lot of like Alanis Morissette and yeah. like Fuck yeah. No Love Doubt choice. and stuff like yep. that. So sure. that's kind of like that era of female singers I've been doing. Sure. You know? Mm-hmm. You know? Fair enough. That uh, kind of stuff. Cheryl Crow slipping in there. Yeah. Um, I, I was Crow. going to, I did a video mm. shoot two weeks ago. I wish I freaking knew you guys back then. Cause I would have <laughs> freaking loved to have you guys to do it with me. Um, we did like, I did 11 videos in six hours. Whoa. What, what do you mean? With like different artists, because what? what I'm trying to do is promote like each week. I want to do like, um, like a uh, feature someone so it'd be like me featuring like Great. say film speed or you know yeah, what i mean yeah, like yeah. Mm-hmm. and then do a cover a youtube series yeah. like where the videos are coming so out. like say ah. like every sunday like post a video with somebody different genius i think it would be so much fun genius. sure I, mean, I would be in it because i'm paying for it you know right, what i mean right, but right. like it would be like me featuring somebody yeah. so Got it. i was gonna do um picture with cheryl crow and uh kid, kid rock, rock. Yeah, yeah but they the guy who was gonna do it he bailed mm. Fuck that guy. Yeah, yeah. fuck him. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, but I was like, oh, that would have been a fun one to do, you know? Yeah, totally. Show Crow's her. great. Yeah, it was fun. I like her stuff. Mm-hmm. She doesn't really sing. I feel like it's more of like a talk. It is a talk singing. Yeah. 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 She's a little more yeah. Tom Petty-ish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bob Dylan-y. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Which wait. I was trying to learn how to <laughs> sing it, yeah. and it was like kind of hard because I'm used to being like, holding out notes yeah, and not like totally. yeah a lot of words a yeah, lot totally. of words yeah pronounce it's like a sing i was rapping. gonna do what's that one? <laughs> oh, freak what's Every that one day. popular one There's that a she lot. does show crow yeah uh all i want to do is have some fun yeah that one 
That one talks a lot. So much. And so I was trying to learn that <laughs> one. I'm like, that one I'm going to not do that one. Yeah. Dude, the shit that she says in that song makes no I fucking I like a good sense. beer buzz early in the morning, and Billy likes to peel the labels from his bottles of bud. Shreds them on the bar, and he lights everyone with an oversized match, letting, the, letting each one burn down to his thick fingers before he's blowing and cushioning them out, watches the bottles of bud as they spin on the floor. Happy couple enters the bar. <laughs> Keep yeah. going. We didn't start <laughs> yeah. the fire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Absolutely, yeah. <laughs> it's the end yeah, of the world. Yeah. 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 They yeah. close to one another. The bartender looks up from his wand ads, and all I want to do is have some fun. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Fair enough. And that's the second verse. It's <laughs> like the second 60 verse. words. I want. In it. Okay. Yeah. Speaking of that song. Yes. Have you ever seen the show Shazam? Like Beat Shazam. Beat Shazam. Wasn't Carlton hosting it for a while? Um, it was. Uh, I didn't see the show. Jamie, There's a movie, right? Jamie, Jamie Fox. Fox. Jamie Fox. <laughs> oh my God, we uh. would be so good at that show. Oh yeah, name that. It's basically like name that tune, right? You have to yeah, name yeah. the song. Yeah, and yeah. It's like the I'm million dollar song was that show Crow song. There you go. We would have won. The million dollar effing question. Yeah. yeah. All right. <sighs> I guess I gotta try out for that show. Yeah. Yep. Uh, yeah. There you I go. Love game show. Pay for so, all so our much records. fun. But that one, I was just like, I don't know if they're doing it right now, but they had like I think three seasons. But <laughs> yeah. dude. Yeah. Like the million dollar. I'm like, are you kidding me? Like, <laughs> did, did the contestant get it? Yeah, she got okay, it. Good. There were some songs I didn't know, like a lot of country songs I didn't know because I don't listen to too much like country pop, yeah. you know. Yeah. But like old school like songs, I'm like, dude, I got this in the bag. <laughs> yeah. A million dollars to name that tune. They just see yeah. you. They're like country song, country song, country yeah, song. Yeah, the million dollar guy. It'll be. Uh, huh. um, yeah. I think they have like a one. <sighs> in during one episode, um, the theme was Imagine Dragons or something. So <laughs> the theme. The theme or like the category. So sure. you had to name all, and it was like they only. They have like six hits. Sorry, six, I got seven hits. With <laughs> right? Yeah, the band's starting up. Yeah. Um. Yeah. The but category was Imagine Dragons. Or like the. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So. Category is Imagine and Dragons. Yeah. Name this artist. Imagine Dragons. Right. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> it was so funny, but they had to name like all the songs. Like all the songs that were gonna pop up were Imagine uh, Dragons, okay. and so you had to like get the right ones. You know, yeah. there's only a top four or whatever that they have. You yeah. know. Yeah, that I know of, and that are they most got, popular got like on the radio. Five or six big yeah. ones. Yeah. You, yeah. You, you want to get in? <laughs> no, probably more than five or six. Uh, but, yeah. So yeah. probably top of the world, radioactive, and Thunder. demons. I'm demons. just talking about the first record. Oh, okay. Uh, oh, there might be one more. Thunder was on it. That's, radioactive. That's second was record, on it. I think. Uh, Thunder first record. Second record is I bet my life on you. Oh yeah. Uh. Third, yeah. <laughs> Third record is Believer, and you just said it, Thunder. Yeah. yeah. And then the next one is Champion and oh, whatever it takes. And <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, whatever. I think I exhausted it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I think yeah. those are all the big radio I songs. Think the, eight or nine. <laughs> yeah. I think the songs that they had to guess were Radioactive, Believer, Thunder, yeah, the and, biggest. Then, and then the, the one, biggest ones. The one yeah. other big one. I can't remember. But yeah. Uh, oh, it's time. Time to begin his. Yeah, it's yeah. also the first record. That's the first record. That, Four, that's like first one. maybe the only one I really like. Oh, I like Believer. Believer's a good song. My boyfriend's nope. cousin <laughs> opened for them. Sick. Cool. Bef- like a long time ago. When they were still in Vegas? Well, I don't know. Yeah, I were. can't remember. But they opened for them, and his band was like doing really well, and then I think they broke up. Oh. But oh, I was like, no. Yeah. Like, you open for them. Yeah, like yeah. you could have made it so far, but his music is super dope. But does he still do music? Yeah, but not with the band. I don't Aww. think. All right, yeah. fair enough. He'll be back. He'll be back. <laughs> In Imagine yeah. Dragons, it always calls you back. <laughs> he is Imagine <laughs> Dragons. How did you guys come up with your name? Uh, Coldplay. Okay. Keanu yeah, Reeves. Just kidding. No. Um, oh. <laughs> uh, so much crazy shit happens in your life, right? Yeah. And when you look back at it, it's, you're not going to remember every detail. Mm-hmm. You're just going to remember like the highlights, as mm-hmm. if it's cut up like a movie about yourself. Yeah. So the more things happen to you, the more you live in that film. Oh. Wow. 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 So deep. Yeah. Also, I can't drive 55. <laughs> I don't even know what I would name. I only drive at film speed. I, I've come up it's with so worst. many different band names, what? and it's like, I just don't even know. Your so. name is great. Yeah, Haley Capella is a good name. Well, I was like trying to do it as a band, and then it just wasn't working out. Haley Capello and the Imagine Dragons. And the Imagine Dragons. So, yep. 
I thought of so many things. Like at one point, I changed my name on stage, ah. and I was just like, "Fuck it, we're gonna be Haley's Comets." But then I was like, "I don't know yeah. if I like that." I was like, "That might be a little too much." Yeah. Um, and then I have all the guys in our band like wear purple shirts. Awesome. Ah. So purple Prince. shirts, black tie. Yeah. There you go. And I just think it's a different color compared to just black, you know. Yeah. yeah. Totally. And so when we do like parties and stuff, it'd be a long purple, like long sleeve shirt Great. yeah you know? and uh yeah so we were the fab foxes for the ro- a while and then everyone's like did you say fat you're a fat fox i'm like uh, no fab like fabulous yeah and then i was like oh that's not gonna work i'm over yep. it i don't know you're gonna get people switching into a g too yeah, yeah. <laughs> you're just setting yourself up for softball yeah, uh, it's definitely don't do it yeah because they would always call us fab oh you guys are so fabulous i'm like oh we're the fab foxes and then yeah. i was like eh we're just gonna be Capello it, Entertainment. It does sound. It Capello sounds good though. Like the Fab Foxes sounds Capello awesome. Capello Entertainment is pretty cool. That's like. Yeah. Well, sounds like a law firm. That's what my <laughs> business name is. So like, when, okay, because I got a business license, so that I don't know, I could write stuff off on my taxes. Sure. Okay. Yeah. No. You good know? call. So. Is yeah. register in California? Yes. Okay. I think so. Huh. It's that extra three hundred dollar thing. Yeah, we're, yeah, yeah. we're gonna do it outside the state. Yeah. Allegedly. I just got a. Um, I just got a. What did I get? Cease I got a assist. not like a hardcore <laughs> license, the one that's really expensive. I just got a fictitious business license. Uh, doing business as DBA. Something like that. Yeah. I don't yeah. know. LLC. It was only twenty five dollars. Oh no. yeah. Yeah, it's just a DBA. Yeah, just DBA. Yeah. Cool. Something oh, and like then that. a resale permit probably. No, something like that. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know. Okay. That's a- yeah, that's just simple business <laughs> shit. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, you can get DBAs and then you get no. you get a sales license or resale license, a resale permit, so that you can like mm-hmm. sell T-shirts and shit. Oh. Ah. With, the, with and being able to claim it. And then claim that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Because you have to claim. I all claim your damage, everything. Yeah. Claim everything. Yeah. Write everything off, dude. Claim I do. Canada. Everything from yeah. getting my nails done to my hair done to everything. Sweet. Mm-hmm. See, that's all. Gas. Already, writing that's off already gas. Pro yeah. moves. So that you, no. That's already pro moves. And you're working with large piece bands. Mm-hmm. You're you're probably scheduling those shows, getting the people together, paying those people out. It's so you're having bitch. them. Yeah. You're putting them in. But that's all right. Like uh, organizing uh, outfits. You're organizing. Yeah. So you're on top of that shit. I have to ask. If someone comes to you and says, hey, I'm just starting out mm-hmm. and I, I just want to be a singer, what no. do you th- what do you think is most important <laughs> say to do no. first? <laughs> um, no. Honestly, like I don't even it, it's hard to answer that for me personally, just because I just like met a whole bunch of people and just networked. And That's huge advice. You for have yeah. to like be able to to not be afraid to try something you know and i played a lot of shows for free i did yeah. a lot and i finally got to a point where i'm like girl i'm almost 30 like i gotta make some money mm-hmm. you know what i yeah, mean totally. and you have to have that certain like i don't want to say you have to have the it factor but you have to be able to talk to people and be likable you yeah. know it's not about making money it's about making a connection I sure think. That's it. and you have Definitely. to have that like i mean what now we're hanging out like yeah you have we have like some sort of connection you know what i mean you right. meet people yeah. you have to have a positive vibe mm-hmm. you know totally. i don't want to work with somebody that's going to use me because i'm never going to do that again right. you know yeah. it's like you have to have that really good communication skills i think that's yeah. huge it is massive yeah. um and you cannot be afraid you know you yeah. have to like be willing <laughs> to work i mean don't get me wrong for the last few days i've been playing freaking bejeweled on my phone all day <laughs> and just not wanting to do anything <laughs> sure. yep. but, but at the same time it's like you have to know like never give up you know because sometimes i'll be like i can't do this anymore like but then it's like what else would i be doing it's what i love you know you just have to have that driven goal because i always thought i'm gonna make it by the time i'm 23 oh yeah. hell no that's it isn't that it? i'm gonna, is I'm gonna the make thing. it by yeah. the time i'm 26 I'm like mm, girl it's another year later I'm yeah. like, All right, i don't even care don't don't put a time frame on it don't ever put a time frame because on it. you never know who yeah. you're gonna meet or what you're gonna do or you know what i mean it's that's all it. about making great connections timing the network yeah. right mm-hmm. yeah totally well i mean there's you know bunch of kids you know in their room just recording things on their laptop yeah. just you know put it on a soundcloud for two plays and shit yeah. Like, yeah how do i what do i do how yeah. do i get further so for you to just say straight up networking mm-hmm. go talk to people yeah sage advice it's totally yeah. true sage. yeah it's great yeah. advice yeah. yeah yeah i think that's like huge you know it's i've met so many people out here i went from knowing no one to go into places and be like oh hey i know you and people recognize me you know and i'm sure. like oh my gosh like in eight years like you can really build something you great. know great yeah. great great yeah. yeah so so uh are you stuck in southern california for good you're not going 
Not going back up to the snore. I mean, I go up there like yeah. to see my family. How and often? Uh, I was supposed to actually be gone this week and next oh. week, but then my my sister had a baby. But ah, congrats! Yeah, he's super cute, but he's in the hospital because he has something going on. He was a preemie, so oh. because he was so tiny, he has he's been in the hospital for a long time. So it's like I can't can't go to the hospital. Yeah. So. Might as well just wait. Yeah, that was the worst you could have Yeah, my car's been scraping places. <laughs> I've been ready. It's my time to change. I'm stepping on a bigger stage. I'm on 